Alright, how's it going folks? What is up? Dylan saying first again. Dylan, how are you so fast? Gerardo, Liam saying forced. We got Niles in the house. Lime, how's it going? Anthony says first. Rand, <laughs> Rand says first. Says lol, Dylan, Kai, Kai, you lying? Actually, Dylan was first. Dylan was first. We said Teresa. Give me the loot. How's it going, my friend? What's up? Please have a million bloodline. Easy fun. I'm sorry I don't have a million bloodline tonight. Charles, how's it going, my friend? What is up? Ten people cannot be first. True. We got Edwin in the house as well. We got Jay Niles. We got Danny. We got Drene. Big cap. We got Vic in the house as well. Is it actually just going to be wheels? Um, well, the problem really is, is that I don't have many packs. So, yeah, so maybe. There's a chance. That 36-12 was the toughest L. Dude, Mitch, I always guess 36. Like, every time I guess numbers, I always guess 36. When I was a child, 36 was um, the bus number on my school bus, like, freaking years ago. So I always guess 36, and it always does well. We got Alexander, what's up? Pride Rock, how's it going? I see my package, I think. Yes, Danny, that is yours. So, Danny, let's see what you said. I don't even remember. But, Danny, let's get into it. So I don't want to reveal... Your address. So let's give it the good old snip. So we have some pretty exciting wheels tonight. So if you haven't had a chance to check out the wheel section, I think a lot of them are full. But there are still some. I also did a ton of shipping. A ton. So I'll go over that as well in a second. But let's see what Danny said. He says, finally, I can see your full Vegito figure. Do you want to see the whole figure? It's out behind me. I can grab it. I had to take it off because it kept falling off. All right, let's make sure there's nothing in here. All right, let's check it out. So, Danny, nothing, no leaks. He says, cards for Express. Nice. Okay, he says, hi, Sauger. These are for your next Express. I have them in a particular order. Okay, perfect. The two in the tag team bag are my friends in the tag team. <laughs> team bag. I just want to keep, um, uh, just want to keep there after my grades and not mix them in. I hope you have a great holiday and stay safe. I love the channel plus the community you created. I probably won't. Um, catch the stream live, but you are awesome. Danny, you caught it! Danny, you caught it! So I love it when you guys send me nice little notes. Thank you. Appreciate that, guys. Okay, so Danny, from what I understand, he says, the two in the team bag are my friends. I just want to keep them after my grades and not mix them in. Okay, so Danny, does that mean those two cards in the team bag are getting expressed? Carl says, how much for the figure? Figure ain't for sale, man. It was a gift. <laughs> Jose says, can you ship my Charizard Hollow to PSA Express, please? Um, yeah. So if you want to get your card in Express grading, um, I really have to kind of restructure the way that I do grading uh, because in the past, it was just payment after the grading comes in, um, which I really have not a problem with. But as we get bigger and bigger, like last month, we sent out over a thousand cards through bulk for like probably like 30, 40 different people. Now, if, you know, for some reason people lose interest or people don't come back, I'm going to have a pretty fat bill on my hand for cards 
And you know what I mean? So yeah. Then he says, yes, okay. So he says, thanks for shipping. Yeah, no problem. So hopefully you guys got your um, your emails. So obviously tracking numbers come through emails. If you guys remember, this this pile was so fat, we are now down to a little bit. So Aaron, I got to get you shipped for your Darcy Blaze box. Robert, I got to get your Vivid Voltage box shipped. Jordan and JR King are going to go together because they're international, but that's the interface ETB in the Phantom Rage. Proud Rock, OU15, and Kurt's the last one. So Kurt, if you are watching tonight, we will open up your shiny V-Box. It says all expressed, okay. All right. Is Express 85 for one card? I'll lie. If you're going through PayPal, then it's 90. So PayPal, it's 90 for Express. Okay. So, Daniel, let's check it out. Blastoise, Charizard, Venusaur. So we got the big three. We also got a W stamp, so that's a duelist stamped Pikachu. We got a nice red cheek shadowless. Looks a little beat up. But still very nice. Got the red cheeks shadowless. We got a shadowless Mewtwo. Ooh, nice. First edition Rockets Mewtwo. Let's get you guys a better view so you guys can see it. Kurt says I'm here. Okay, perfect. Okay. We got a Sabrina's Gengar first edition as well. We got nice. We got the Japanese Gym 2 Gengar. Got a Dark Dragonite. Ooh, hoo, hoo, hoo. Dragonite first edition. That is one hot card. Now, of course, not in the perfect shape, not like pack fresh, but still, it's a first edition Watsy card. Absolutely worth getting graded. Very nice. We got the Japanese Team Rocket EX, or not EX, Team Rocket Returns. Okay, we also have another Japanese Dark Dragonite, so you have them in a specific order. So I'm going to keep those in that order, and let's see how the, uh, the baggy cards are. Brody says, you shipped my Shiny V-Box with my Evos. Yes, Brody, I did. So, Brody, hopefully you got the email from me. But, yeah, Brody, I have your package sitting over there with the rest of them. But, yes. So, I did get a Shiny V shipment in today. So, I was able to give you guys the boxes. Finally. <laughs> Finally. And then we have a Dark Blastoise. And we also have a Gengar. Pretty good shape. A little bit of whitening on it. But still pretty good shape. All right. So, Danny. What we're going to do is we're going to try to keep the order proper. So we're going to keep the order properly. Devin says, what's your time zone there? Because I waited two hours and now it's 10 here. Devin, it's 11. <laughs> it's 11 here. Big Bot says, I got my stuff today. Thanks, Augur. Yeah, Big Bot, no problem. I'm glad it just arrived kind of quick because a lot of people are having to wait a long, long time for shipping uh, just due to the backup of the post office. Okay, so Danny, whew, that's hot. And we are going to keep the order for you. But yeah, so a lot of people did get shipped. Uh, like I said, a lot. The shiny V wheel did come in. So Mitch, I shipped you. Uh, Blub, I shipped you. Brody, I shipped you. Paul says, shiny V pack tonight, how much per pack? Yeah, so Paul, this is not the 40 box order that I have. So the 40 box order is still in transit. And I'm going to have to try to, like, talk to the seller because at this point, I mean, I don't think it's lost. I think USPS just really might be backed up. But, um, yeah, so this one didn't come in. This one was a pretty small one. Plus, I already owed a lot of people shiny V-boxes, so I actually don't have that many. <laughs> He says, thanks, sorry, I was scared it got lost in the holiday shipping. Danny, I totally understand that. But thankfully, it did come today. I don't think a lot of stuff is getting lost. I think a majority of what's happening is things are just getting slowed down and everything is... I think at one point, someone told me that they have mail just sitting in, like, a container. <laughs> like, they, like, get little, like, shipping containers, the big metal ones. So we're going to put them upside down. That way they stay in the same order. Little trick right there. It says, did you ship my bag? Uh, Manuel, I did it. I did it. So Manuel, if you want to get shipped, make sure you're requested. And if you are requested in there, there's a chance I didn't get to you. The list was huge. But I did ship a ton of people um, as well as all of the fossil box hits. Make 
each of the Venusaurs all the way in its sleeve. Got the Duelist stamp. Axel says, did you ship my net? Yes, Axel, I did ship you. Yep. So Axel, I believe you had some CP6 stuff. And you also had a shiny V-Box. So yes, Axel, I shipped you a uh, shiny V-Box seal. I bought a few cards on eBay last week and they came in before the projected date. That was through USPS. They hit and missed at the moment. Yeah, so Saunders, that's actually true because I obviously ship a lot of stuff and I'll check my pirate ship list of all the shipments, you know, from time to time to make sure nothing's just like, you know, showing like it's lost or anything. And yeah, some people get it pretty quick. Okay, so we got the Red Cheeks Shadowless. But that actually reminds me. So Saunders, if you are buying things off of eBay, so if you guys do like the channel and you want to support what we're doing over here, and there's an easy way to do it without actually, I guess, spending extra money that you wouldn't. So what I'm talking about is an eBay affiliate link. So in our description, we do have an eBay affiliate link. If you click that link and purchase something after you click the link, it doesn't cost you any extra money, and eBay will actually give me money. <laughs> So eBay will give me money from the sale at no extra cost to you. All right. So Daniel, let's get all of these sleeved up and ready to go. So we did just send out our last express shipment this Monday. So this, this one will probably go out in about a week. So there is still time to get in cards for express if you'd like. Express remains unchanged, but bulk is still remaining or waiting for bulk to see if they make a change. I really strongly think that PSA will not make a change to their Express. Probably just their bulk, if I had to guess. He says, I didn't want to see your ship still. I heard you shipped and I want to see if mine is still there. Yes, Emmanuel, it's still here. So sorry if I'm reading chat a little slow. Trying to make sure I'm very delicate because these are some nice, nice cards. Not sure if you saw Demi's message about the Blastoise, just confirming, Saga, that you can give it to him when you can. Robert, I did we do that already or not? We'll have to check tonight. Robert, I don't remember if I did that already, but okay. Gotcha. We may or may not have. Okay. So Danny, tons of Dragonites. Thunderstruck, how's it going? He says, afternoon, folks. So Danny, if you want, you can try to give me two initials, or I guess initials, for your friend. That way, when I put them in for the submission, I can, I guess, separate you guys, if that makes sense. But they'll go right back to back. So damn, I want that chubby Pikachu. Yeah, so Vivid Voltage, we cracked four cases so quick. I thought four cases would be, you know... <laughs> Enough for a while? Uh, it really wasn't. I think it's mostly due to the battles, which we will obviously continue doing. But I guess I just have to uh, get more. I just have to get more. Yo, Alexis, what's up? He says, what did you poke again? Yo, Alexis, I was trying to ship your stuff today. So, Alexis, I'm not sure if I have your address. So, Alexis, please do send me your address on Discord or Facebook. Because, Alexis, I went, I checked, and I didn't have you in my contact book, which I feel like I shipped you before. But I guess I must have not. But yeah, you have a lot of cool stuff here, Alexis. I already have it all packed up. I uh, just need your address. That means like we burned through it. We really did. Okay, so Danny, these are all of cards for you. I feel bad for the USPS. They're trying the best with what they got. No, no, Saunders, honestly, no hate to them. No hate to them at all. Okay, so there it is. The final order. Keep them like this, and, and now let's grab your two friends. Yo, Stormax, how's it going? Okay, I'm going to put DM2, but if you guys don't know, DM2 is actually an abbreviation for diabetes. <laughs> so it's kind of funny. 
Alexis says, you have not shipped mine yet. Ship me yet. Yeah, so Alexis, time to ship you. So Alexis, feel free to drop me your address uh, through either Discord or Facebook. So I have it all packed up and just need your address. Yeah, you have a lot of stuff. You had CP6 stuff. You had a lot of the empty packs from the fossil break. So we sent those out in the last express, but you still have the packs. that have all your pack fresh common and commons. He says, I wanted to wait till the Zard comes back uh, from grading to ship if that's cool. Alexis, to be honest with you, the Zard is going to be a while. It's going to be a while. Because that one got, I believe you were in the one that got sent out on, what, mo this Monday. So that's going to take a while. So I don't know if you really want to wait that long. Plus, shipping is really not that expensive. So, you know what I mean? I'm not, it's, you know. If you really want to, Alexis, though, we absolutely can do that for you. DM2 does work. I'll be getting the diabetes. <laughs> Honor says, you have a medical background? Yeah. Wouldn't really say medical in that way, but yes. All right. So, Danny, there it is. Got two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, and fifteen cards, including your friends. All right, so we're going to stick them back here. So, you want them in this exact order, which means I'm going to stick them like this. We have Goldie's base set two, and behind that, we have Michael's hollow, hollow bleed. Charizard from Evos. Okay, so all those in Express. Dodge coin? Josh says, oh no, we ate all the vivid voltage. Yes. <laughs> yes. All right. So let's check what we're working with. Just ordered my semi-rigid. Can't wait to sell my cards for grading. Yeah, Matt, so nice. Semi-rigids have started to come back down in price, so it's pretty nice. So it is pretty nice. He said, show me the cards and the rest of the cards instead. I'll send them to PSA. Okay, Jose, you got it. Jose, just keep in mind that when you ship stuff to PSA, you also have to pay for the shipping there and back. So it's, a, it's more expensive than the website would advertise. I'll send you my address then to ship what I have, but I believe the Zard was a while back when you sent it. Okay, Alexis, let's check. I can check real quick. And Alexis, thank you very much, man. $4.99. But Alexis is the big baller, bro. Thank you, man. Okay, so our next one coming back. Right. So let me just control F. All right, so Alexis, you are in the 35 card sub, which PSA is basically not even worked on. So our next one that's at PSA is in grading still. It's been there for three weeks, and it's still in grading. And after that, Alexis, you're in that one. So it is probably at least going to be like another month, even though it's express. This guy says, I love how this page is growing. Okay, so guys, let's go ahead. Let's do the wheels. You guys are probably excited. You guys are probably excited because we have some fire coming up in the wheels tonight we have the pokemon first movie tops so we have some tops packs obviously there's a little more than that and we also have the japanese team rocket and a japanese gym too this can have a blaine's charizard in it and of course these can have the dark charizard as well as the naughty grimer and these actually has a lot of band cards. So these are actually some really good packs because they can also have band cards. But like I said, a ton of people have been shipped. So if you see your card here, that means I owe you something. So Kurt, you're actually here. So Kurt, let's open up your shiny V-Box. Let's do that first. So Proud Rock OU15, Jordan and JR King, you guys are international, want to ship together. So I'll do that later. Robert, you were at the bottom of the list, didn't get you quite yet. And same thing with Aaron. But you guys are definitely all set and I'll get to you guys hopefully tomorrow. All right, so Kurt, let's do it. That says, how much are they? Yeah, so Manuel, the um, the tops packs, those are thirty dollars each. Uh, the vintage packs are already sold. Vivid Voltage Booster Box or a first edition Team Rocket Pack, uh, Master. I would say the Team Rocket Pack, but you'd have to see if it's weight or not. So like, you would need more information. If that makes sense. Okay, so Kurt, this should have been to me so long ago that this is still the first print. So that's actually a little better. 
So everyone that got a sealed box from me actually got a first edition box. So very, very nice. If those don't know, the non-first edition now have a stamp there and the, the code cards don't actually have a code. So that's how you can tell. So he says, thank you, sir. I appreciate it. Yeah, so Stewie, definitely just got to get to you, my friend, but I got you. It's going to be sent to you sealed. Matt says, any way to buy a box of Shining Star V directly from you? Uh, Matt, I don't have that many, and I think I'm going to continue to do them for the wheel. So if you really wanted one directly, I mean, you could buy basically about all the spots the wheel, but then you'd basically be paying a lot for it. Chris says, baller. Ashkay, how's it going, my friend? He says, what's up, Saga Bro? How's it going, Ashkay? Bitch is like, let's go. Okay, so Kurt, hopefully you're ready. Okay, so Kurt, you will definitely be getting all of your hollows and such. Um, but if you want, honestly, I'll send you the code cards too. <laughs> so we'll just keep all the bulk if that's okay with you. But anything that's shiny or the codes you'll be getting. He says, you got it wrong. The box you have there is second print. Yeah, well, we'll see. We'll see. He says, First Prince has a stamp. Is that true? Is that true? Okay, then I might be misinformed. Kurt says, yep, let's do this. Okay. Kurt, let's do it. So come on, man. Shit. Will you only be doing wheels today? Uh, so, Finn, there are packs for sale, albeit not that many. So, the list, as you can see, is a little barren. So, a little barren. So, the rest of the cool cards are cool. Perfect. Okay. Kurt, perfect. Okay, Kurt, let's do it. We've opened up a ton of shiny V. So much. So much shiny V, and we have yet to pull a god pack, but we have pulled two shiny Charizards. Not the V Maxes, two of the Vs. All right. Kurt, we got you 10 fresh packs. Let's do it. Stamp over the V is the first print. Are you selling shiny V packs? Ah, uh, man, no, I don't have much. Alexis says, I sent you a message on Discord. Okay, perfect. Alexis, thank you. Yes, yeah, so what am I doing? Let's do it two at a time. Okay. Kurt, let's do it. Johnny says, I just sent it for two Evos. Okay. But yeah, so steadily working down the list, I got a lot of stuff shipped. We had a lot of stuff that needed to get shipped. So Mitch, everything got shipped to you. Mitch, you had a Neo Binder. Your box was huge. You had a Neo Binder. I think you had a Phantom Rage box. And you had a Shiny V box. But yeah, I got everybody shipped. So a lot, of, lot less energy cards there. But there is only so much time in a day. <laughs> okay, so I am really, really hoping for you to get a god pack. We have not got one yet. But yeah, so I still have 40 of these coming that have suddenly just been like, seems like they're lost. But when the 40 do come, I will have packs for sale. But right now, I owed a lot of people boxes from the wheels, so I don't have that many left. All right. Okay, so yeah, so you were right. Okay, so I was misinformed. The stamp is the first print. Okay, so Fleckas, you are absolutely correct. So as you guys can see, this code card does not actually have a code on it. Ooh, but it is the Charizard VMAX. Okay, so good to know that. All right, so I had it backwards. Thanks for letting me know. All right, our first pack is a Appleton. And we got the Ditto VMAX. Okay, and where are my sleeves? So unprepared. Mitch had a thick bag, true. Kyle says, I had hella shit. Yes, Kyle, I got you shipped as well. So Kyle, hopefully you got the email. Okay, so our first hit is the Ditto VMAX. Now, what we have seen coming out of these boxes is they kind of follow a theme. They kind of follow a trend. So we might see a little Ditto in the future here. Ooh, nice. We got a shiny baby Toxicroak. Toxtricity, I mean. And we got a Dragapult and a Garbodor. Gabador. So yes, Kyle, you got shipped. A lot of people got shipped. A lot of people did. 
All right. So, God Pack, please. God Pack, please. Cal says, how much you sell them for? Cal, I don't have any more for sale. Other than the wheels coming up and the ones that I owed to people. Okay, we got a Cramorant. Trevenant. Okay, Santa Cobra, Hoopa, Toxitricity, and a Bolton, and a Bolton Hollow in the back. It's like noise. Icy says, my God pack was the first pack of the box. Dude, Icy, how are you so lucky? <laughs> Icy is really, really lucky. Yo, King Taco, what's up? Yo, Taco, did you get the package? Or the envelope, I mean? And we got a Zashian. Last toys is better than Charizard. Changed my mind. Ooh. I don't know, man. I have to just disagree. <laughs> I just have to just disagree. I think Charizard's better. But I would agree that Venusaur is the last. Okay, we got, I think, Sinistee. And we got another Toxtricity. A whole ton of Toxtricity. It's like, aight, aight, aight. I just pulled a Rainbow Charizard and Brexit. And I don't know what's going on. Bro, Icy, man. Cool. Icy, man. I don't know how he does it. Okay, I got the air balloon. Oh, nice. Here is our first amazing rare and the Eternatus right here in the back. He says Venusaur is the best. Do you, wait, do you really think so? <laughs> do you really think so? I know um, if you guys know Gary, so Gary, the guy with all the Charizards, his favorite Pokemon is Venusaur, actually. Yes, sir, I got it. Thank you. I'm headed to Vegas Monday. So happy that I got it before I left. Nice. Okay, so King Taco, nice. Okay, Clefable. And we got a shiny baby Cramorant. So see, we did pull a Cramorant already. And now we got the full art shiny. So the boxes do kind of run by like a theme almost. Oh, we got the Pikachu VMAX code. Okay, we got the... Oh, nice. Shiny baby Eskew. And we got a Rillaboom. Is there an ETA on the next time Vivid Voltage will be available? Yes, Josh. ETA is in a couple days. Just a couple days. When are you going to get more hidden fates? Tell the USPS to hurry up. Yeah, so Alexis, the hidden fates, the problem with hidden fates is that other than the ETBs, it's really hard to get it now. I actually do have some. So I do have some, but not much. Yeah, Ariados. We got a full art, I believe. And, ooh, we got Piers. So, full art Piers and the Draco Zolt. Nice. I was about to say, where's our full art? Alright, so our boy Piers taking on a whole new appearance from when he was in Darkness of Blaze. <laughs> kind of funny. Alright, so Kurt, there it is. Congratulations, Kurt. You won that box so long ago, man. So, thank you for being patient. And working with me there, USPS just kind of had me. And the one that I ordered a month ago still hasn't come. <laughs> so thanks for uh, understanding that, Kurt. And thanks for waiting. I opened up a Crazy Invasion pack for some reason. Got six of first hollows. Yeah, so Alexis, that actually doesn't happen a lot. But yeah, but yeah, definitely has some issues. The Pokemon company is not very good at printing Pokemon cards. Funny enough. <laughs> funny enough. All right, let's go ahead. Let's get you a baggie. Okay, and we're going to hop over the wheels. So, Kurt, there it is. So, Kurt, like I said, once again, thank you so much for just being super patient with that. And I think, Kurt, you might have been like one of the first few people to win, too. So, Kurt, I feel like you were the one that won the box first and you were waiting the longest. But, Kurt, nonetheless, nice. You did get that full art pierce. Okay, and I'm liking it. The bag area is pretty light. Did so much shipping, so I'm happy with that. Kurt says, thanks. Yeah, no problem. I just bought you five mines. Booster box, you're recommending me opening it or keeping it sealed? 
Actually, that's a good point. So, Denim, honestly, it depends. If you want to hold it as an investment, the reprint already happened. So, I think in terms of it getting reprinted again, that's probably really low. You know what I mean? Because it literally just got reprinted. Cap. So, guys, let's do the wheels. Uh, let's hop over to Discord. Rakeem, are we live? Rakeem, what's up? All right, so guys, this is the Discord. If you are not already a part of the Discord, make sure you are, because that's pretty much where everything goes down. So as you can see, I pretty much left off here at, at Jacob. So Jacob, you're back. I actually skipped a little bit because you guys had so much stuff just chilling that I had to get you guys shipped. But as you guys can see, I made a huge chunk, like started up here all the way, like right here next to like, to um, next to Chad. So huge, huge amount of shipping went down as well as people that were owed that stuff. But what we're talking about today are the Royal Wheels. So if you did miss these, there will be some more banger wheels up tomorrow. And let's be honest, these wheels are pretty fire. So we still have an Evo's wheel that is running, has some spots left. We have one shiny V-Box here. We also have 10 CP Zards if you're interested in that. Uh, first of all, if you want to play on the wheels, uh, make sure you read the post first before you actually participate. We also have a uh, Japanese Riverside. That's basically Southern Islands. We also have a PSA... 9 EVOS Charizard. So there are a couple spots left that does fill tonight. We will spin and someone's taking home a PSA 9 EVO Zard. Rand going all out. And getting a ton of spots. So Rand, you got... Yes, yeah, so Rand. Let's see, man. Good luck. We also have five tops packs. Tyler, you're... You're ganging up on Zack here. We also have a PSA 8 Shadowless Charmander as well, if you're interested in that. And we have two Team Rocket packs as well as another Shiny Star V-Box. So absolute, absolute bangers on the wheels tonight. He says, what time do the wheels go out? Michael, that's actually a good question. Um, you know, sort of whenever. <laughs> sort of whenever. So I guess the best way to know when the wheels come out is after we post them, we make an announcement. All right. So Mitch is like, David versus Goliath. True. True. But we've seen, we've seen upsets before. We really have. All right, so let's do it. All right, so check out this huge wheel. This one was from yesterday when we did that giveaway. A hundred people. All right, so let's start over here at the top. All right, we got our first box is a whole booster box of Shiny Star V. So yeah, that, last, that giveaway at the end of last night's stream was massive. Okay, so guys, here it comes. We're not going to full screen or anything. We're just going to shuffle a bunch. He's like, he's picking a fight with me. True. <laughs> True. And good luck. Only one can win. And it looks like Gary Boggs is easily, easily taking that. Gary, you had a nice chunk of blocks right there. Yo, Chanel, what's up? So now we took down the bull castle. <laughs> we took down the bull castle. All right. So Gary, congratulations. Winning yourself a shiny star V-Box. So Gary, if you'd like, let me know if you do want that sent to you sealed or if you prefer to open it on stream. Either way it works for me. Just let me know. So Gary, congratulations. All right. Now on to the second wheel. Not full. Next wheel, this is for a Japanese Riverside. For those who do not know, Riverside, there's actually, I think, six total binders that comprise of the Japanese Southern Islands. So this is one of the six. Let's see who wins. Yo, Alan, what's up? He says, what up, see? Alan ain't never want to talk to me, man. He only wants to talk to Chanel. <laughs> King says, who can host the wheel? Uh, King, only us. You're not going to keep it for the winner? Chanel, honestly, I'm sure I'll have more. <laughs> I'm sure I'll have more. All right. So here it comes, guys. Refresh the page. Going in for the random shuffles. And let's see who wins. It's like, Zachy, it's a dub. Let's go. All right. Coming up, we got... Zach. Nice. Okay. 
Okay, and Zach, obviously that is going to go over to you sealed. <laughs> so. So kids are cool. Congratulations. All right. So kids are cool. There it goes. Japanese herbicide. So of course that's going to go to you sealed. I don't see any reason why you'd want that open on stream. So I'm going to ship that to you sealed. And that's probably the best choice. He's like, let's go. Yo, Alex, I'm back after five months. Alex used to be a regular. He said, guys, I'm quitting Pokemon. He said, no Fab November. He said, no, no Pokemon November. No jokes. Zach, Johnny says, I sent for an evil wheel slot. Okay, yeah, so Johnny, if you're obviously if you're playing it, Johnny, I think you already knew that. But yeah, if you sent the money to Sonny as you should, he'll definitely update you on the wheel. Okay, there's a couple more spots left on our PSA 9 Evo Zard. Our next wheel is for a Japanese Gym 2 pack. And we got Rand versus Mitch. Rand is taking on. <laughs> okay, so let's hit a refresh. All right, let's do it. Good luck. Rand versus Eddie and Mitch. So Rand getting eight out of the 10 spots. Okay. Okay, looks like it's going. Oh, no way. Oh, no way. Oh, my God, Rand. Rand, I'm so sorry, dude. I kind of saw that. Oh, no. No. Rand, I am so sorry, dude. Oof. Oh. Oh. Dude, Mitch, you are so lucky. Mitch, you are so lucky, Mitch. Oh, boy. All right. Mitch, one gym, two pack. Over to you. That is insane. That is insane. Oh, boy. Okay, our next one is for five tops booster packs. Okay, Tyler, good luck. Tyler versus Zach over here. JOC says, how do I get in this? Uh, Joe, you need to get into the Discord and go under Royal Wheels and make sure you read it. Mitch says, sealed for sure. Thank you. Okay. So, Mitch, let me write an S on your card real quick. All right. Rand says, and unsubbed. <laughs> Rand, I'm sorry, man. Mitch is way too lucky. Mitch is way too lucky. That should not have happened. All right, so now we got Tyler versus Zach. Good luck. This is like, well, Zach's winning this one. He says, let's see another big upset. All right, here it comes. Only one can win. Oh, okay, there's no way. There's no way. All right, so there it is. Tyler taking the five tops packs. Okay, so five tops. Say yo, bro, is $20 for a base set Pikachu, Charmander, and Squirtle a good price? All are with Shadow. Ashke, it just depends on the condition and if they're first edition. Okay. So, Tyler, here it comes. Five tops packs. Ben's like, underdog, let's go. One spot in a dream. <laughs> All right, we have another PSA 8 Shadowless Charmander. That is up on the wheels if you're interested as well. We have two more wheels to go. This next one is for two Team Rocket Booster packs. Hit the old refresh. And let's shuffle. Mitch is like, bro, I'm so lit right now. <laughs> Mitch, you've been winning hella wheels, dude. I shipped you so much stuff today, Mitch. That is nuts, Mitch. You are very lucky, so congratulations. All right. Here it comes. Who's going to take it? Who's going to take it? And it's going over to the man, Tyler, winning the two Team Rocket Packs. He says, Tyler must love the rush. <laughs> okay, so Tyler taking home another win. The two-team rocket packs. 
Okay, and our last wheel for tonight, unless the others fill, is for a Shiny V Booster Box. All right, let's hit a good old refresh. So Tyler always hitting fire. Tyler to not be denied. All right, let's do it. Shuffle a bunch. And our last wheel. And this is going over to... Right past Mitch, over to my man Kirk. So Kirk, there it is. All right, and Kirk, if you do want that opened and or, uh, you know, sent to you sealed, let me know. Okay, so Kirk, congratulations. Shine a V-Box. We're going to pop you in there. Okay, so that was it for all the wheels that are, are full. If any more do fill throughout the stream, we will spin them when they fill. And um, yeah, congrats to all the winners. As always, if you did win, make sure you let me know if you want it sealed or opened. Either way is cool with me. It's totally up to you. Kurt Cobain. <laughs> okay, so let's do a quick little recap. And then we'll begin getting the orders done. So like I said, really, 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 really dry. Um, mail is just taking so long. So it's hard to get nice restocks. Uh, wrong pile. <laughs> wrong pile. All right, so let's check it out. Man, we got a lot of cards again. All right, so Kirk. My friend, you want a shiny V-Box? Let me know if you want that sealed or opened. We'll get you if you want it opened. If not, I'll just send it to you sealed. We also got Tyler, who won the two rocket packs. Tyler, as always, let me know. You want those sealed or opened. Tyler also won the five tops packs. We had Mitch, who won the gym two pack. He let me know he wants it sealed, so very nice. We got Kids Are Cool, who got the Japanese Riverside. Uh, of course, that is going to be shipped to you sealed. Gary Boggs, congratulations on your win. Let me know, my friend, if you would like it shipped sealed or opened. Pride Rock, are you 15? Aaron, got to get your Darkness Blaze Bag shield. I know, or Darkness of Blaze box shipped. I know you want it sealed. And Robert, everyone's sealed. So you guys are all taken care of. But the people that just did win tonight, let me know. I want one top pack sealed and open everything else. Okay. Tyler is in the house. The stim checks came in. I think they come around. How much to buy in on the Zard? Ah, uh, yes. Yeah, so if you are trying to be in the Zard wheel, check out our Discord server and read under uh, Royal Wheels. Okay, so Tyler, let's do it. He wants five tops packs. So he wants one sealed and one opened. So Tyler, what I'm going to do is I actually have a, quite a few of these. So Tyler, let me pick you one that looks really nice. Rand says, sell me a Gym 2. I just want to open one. So Rand, if you want, I do have another Gym 2 pack. Rand, if you wanted to just act like you're buying out the whole wheel, I would do that. So if you want to do it and just send me the money directly like you bought out a whole wheel... I'll open you up a gym two pack. I know you tried to do that with Sunny, so I'm sorry that that happened. Kind of sucks that you lost, but yeah. Or Mitch is trying to sell it too, so you could possibly buy it off of Mitch. Or if you want to buy one, you could just buy one like you bought the whole wheel. Okay. So Tyler, pick you out one that looks pretty nice. Actually, I guess I didn't even see the little crease right there. Just give me a sec. There it is. Got shifted to the bottom. I was like, where the hell did it go? All right, so Tyler, let's pack one up to send to you sealed. Should have just done that, got screwed over, and refunded two spots because it went full. Yeah, so Rand, unfortunately, Sunny is kind of obligated to sort of, it's whoever sent, you know, it's payment first. But yeah, Rand, if you're ever trying to make big moves like that, just send a message beforehand. You know what I mean? And Rand, if you really want to buy out a whole wheel... You absolutely could just message me as well. I mostly, I usually always have duplicates of things that I put up, pretty much. So you could always do that too, but yeah, Rand, I'm super sorry that you got burned on that. I sent my pen payment for the wheel to the wrong Venmo. Okay, Josh, so unfortunately, I, I will be able to let Sonny know that you paid me and he'll put you in, but you're going to have to wait a little bit until I get back to the orders. All right, so looking official, man. I like it. All right. I was all alone on the name wheel, then, <laughs> then he smacked nine spots. <laughs> all right. So, Tyler, we got you one shipped sealed, and he wants four open. Tyler, let's do it. 
When will there be another Silent Islands? I still need two sets. The one with Togepi mainly. Lord Drifton, there will be. There will be more. But I probably will do them in, um, what's it called? Like, sets again. I probably won't do one for just one. Okay, Tyler, I'll do my best to try to preserve the pack for you. But no promises. No. <laughs> You'd think I'm good at this, but usually I cut vintage stuff. Jesus, how much is uh, each of those packs? They're about $30. He says, damn, I think I sent you to Sunny, but isn't the PayPal the same? Ah, uh, no, Johnny, it's not the same. All right, so the chase cards out of these are actually the die cut cards. So let's take a look. And with these tops cards, a lot of the time, they actually stick really, really bad. So getting PSA 10s are actually kind of rough. He's like, pack ruin. Tell us, I'm not worried about it. So if they are a little sticky, that's kind of, that's kind of how it goes. They kind of stick to one another. Oh, nice. We got introduction. Check that out. Okay, we got Mechanical Mewtwo. And Tyler, I will sleeve these up for you as well. We got Teamwork. Pikachu's Vacation. Oh, I think I see something back there. Okay, we got Togepi in Trouble. Oh, we got our hollow right there. So, like it never happened. And we got a great day. And we got a nice. We got a Dragonair. So, very nice. So, there are 12 different chase cards. And there are also some die cut and boss cards as well. And those are kind of the ones you want. There is a Charizard that you can pull. Alright. So, Tyler, let's quickly get all these sleeved up. There's not too many, so it shouldn't take me too long. Like it says, I have thousands of those cards. Yeah, I'm actually not that ex or not that experienced at tops. I saw that you has a weird spot on the reverse hollow part. Otherwise, it looks pretty gem mint. I wonder how it affected. A great day is an error. What's the error? It says Pikachu on the back. I have it too. Uh, it says Pikachu turns and runs to Buru, Raichu, Pika Blue, and Cubone. Pika Blue? Yo, they called Meryl Pika Blue. That's nuts. For those that didn't know, Meryl, there was rumors of like Pika Blue when Meryl was first coming out and it was teased. That's actually crazy. It really did just say Pika Blue right there. Okay, so that was your first pack. I will send you the wrapper unless you really don't care about it. <laughs> Amelia says, hello, these are some weird cards. I don't think I've seen them before. Yeah, so Amelia, these are tops. I want the Togepi who owns that. These are Tyler's. I gotta pee so bad. That one says it's officially my birthday. Yo, Edwin, happy birthday. There's also a Dwarfin typo. Jeez. Matt says, that's what I know him as. Pika Blue. All right. Okay, we got clones making a vile plume clone. Making sure nothing stuck to it. We got the invitation. The Tempest, a bad omen. Like it never happened, so we already got a duplicate. Oh, the tail end of a race. Nice. We got Charizard just sleeping. All right, we got a Pikachu's Vacation. 
And for our all whoa, back to back, a Pikachu's vacation. And oh, nice, we got Venusaur. Very nice. So Venusaur. So E3. Okay, so back to back of Pikachu's vacation. He says, oh wait, this is the set I own the entire of. I always wonder where it came from. <laughs> I see, I had no clue where it came from. That's kind of funny. But honestly, it'd be like that. Sometimes you just get stuff in collections and you have no clue what it is, but hey, you just have it. You know, it says they're pretty cute. So yeah, these are snippets from the movie. So yeah, the line is looking to be about 10, 12 people long, but we will get to the line as soon as we finish up these packs. And Tyler, I don't know if you, Tyler, you won the Team Rocket packs too. So Tyler, let me know if you wanted those um, sealed or opened. CS Man says, is there any vintage English you would like to sell? Uh, CS Man, I actually was really close to buying a English base set box, but no, I don't have any English. I will very soon though, actually. <laughs> if, the, if my deal goes nice. Okay, this one opened up nice. Coming a little expert here. Oh, it says open. Okay. All right, we've got Rebellion. Meowth times two. We've got Dawn Fan. <laughs> so yeah, spelled Dawn Fan incorrectly. We got another great day. Oh, so many cards stuck to each other. Okay, the tears of Pokemon. Our hollow is playtime. Another card here. We got rest and relaxation. And a Squirtle. Nice. I think he says sealed. Ooh, never mind. Opened. Okay, so Tyler, we will also get you your rocket packs. So Tyler, I did ship you and Rand. I did ship both of you guys your fossil blisters. So hopefully you guys did get the tracking numbers. So yeah, I did ship both of you guys. I thought we were going to do a fossil blister battle. <laughs> okay. I just stole this dude's song or girl's song. I just stole this dude's girl. Kyle, who's, who's girl? Pokemon says, yeah, Pokemon, there's probably not going to be a big line. So Chanel and Pokemon, don't worry about it. Just relax. And I'll handle the line. Okay, Dawn fan. Okay, so Tyler, I really, really, really want to see you get one of the embossed cards. We haven't got it yet. All right, Tyler, our last one. Josh says, I can't wait for Shining Fates. Yes, so I will actually have a ton of Shining Fates. I was able to secure from many different sources. So yeah, I, I will get a lot of Shining Fates. So that's nice. Tyler, I'm sorry. I had to open one like this. I really wanted to. It was killing me. <laughs> it was killing me. I had to try it. Oh, I leaked the back card. Okay, so we got Rescuing Pikachu. Trying out the new toy. Nice. Okay, we got the Battle of Champions. The fight rages. We got Charizard and his clone fighting each other. We got playtime. Teamwork. Our hollow is a Battle of the Champions. I actually really like that. The hollow cloud right here is actually pretty nice. And we got another Dragonair. All right. Do you have any vintage you want to sell? I see this man, no. The vintage usually goes to the wheels, unless you're doing a box break. It's the Shining Fates battle, I'm hyped. Yeah, so they will have tints. So we'll probably have some form of battles for Shining Fates. So the opening of these makes me want to watch the movie. Yo, Matt, I was actually just thinking the same thing. I was like, dude, it's been a while. 
Maybe, maybe I should watch it again. Right. There it is. Tyler says, how much of these do you have? I'd like all these top cards. Uh, Tyler, I probably have like 15 more packs. Okay. The movie was the ish when it came out in theaters. True. <laughs> True. This man says, how much are the tops? I sell them for $30 a pack. All right. Jay Stowe says, Sagar, is there any way you can send me info on making lists like you do on Discord for wheel spins? I would appreciate it. I'd like to try to sell some items. Unfortunately, we don't let other people do wheels. It's just me. So everything on the wheels is me. I have it in hand. I ship it to you. So that way there is no chance of anything wrong going on. So yeah, I handle all of that. Everything comes through me and I see everything to make sure everything's legit and good before it goes out to you guys. But if you are wanting to try something, Jaysto, you can definitely just send me a message on Discord and I'll see what, you, uh, what, you're, what you're after. All right. Tyler, tops. Now on to your two Team Rockets. And Mitch, let's get that put away for you as well. Okay, so Mitch, this pack is actually a beauty. Gym 2 is probably one of my favorite Japanese sets to open just because it has so many good hits. So many nice hollows. Of course, you always get a hollow every time. And it also has a ton of band cards. You have Sabrina's Gaze, the Ninja, Koga's Ninja Trick, and others. The 2000 movie one has the movie cells, right? Movie cells? All right, I don't actually quite know what you're asking. All right, so Mitch, I'm going to pop this over here so I know to ship that over to you, and I'm going to get rid of your card. Okay, so Mitch, you're all set. Tyler, we're getting your rocket packs. And we're good. All right. All right. Tyler, let's do it, my mans. So we are looking for Naughty Grimer, or we are looking for the Japanese Dark Charizard, Dark Blastoise, or the Dark Dragonite. So let's do it. Aaron's like, hey, Team Rocket, let's do it. Okay, so these are for Tyler. Tyler, congratulations on winning the wheel. All right. Let's check it out. We got Zubat, Psyduck, Primate. Ooh, nice. You got Charmander, Mankey, Machoke. We got, I think that's like Super Digger. We got Persian and a Dark Flareon. Okay, so Tyler, no Naughty Grimer in that one. He said, the second pack has a Zard. Watch my words. Okay. Tyler, here it comes. Boom! And it's a Dark Hypno. Okay, so we got Dark Hypno with the psych psychedelic background. Super what? Super what? <laughs> it is Garbage Night Run. All right. 
All right, let's see your second pack. Do you have a Dark Gyarados Japanese card for sale? Zach, I definitely do have one. I definitely, definitely do. Okay. Okay, so Tyler, we are on our set. Oh, another Zubat. And a Psyduck. This is looking like the same pack. Prime Ape. Okay, there we go. Voltorb. Slowpoke. Oh, nice. Dark Dragonair. Coughing. Porygon. And a trainer. I'm over here waiting to another Shiny V battle. Heads up, five packs, but your supply would zoom out the window. Yes. So, Matt, when I get my my 40 boxes of Shiny Star V, we will do that all day and night. Who <laughs> says, so, sorry, how do I get packs? This is going to be my first time. Yeah, so, Devin, in the description of the live stream, there's a pretty good step-by-step uh, -step on how to get stuff. All right, Tyler. Boom, and it's a Dark Dug Trio. All right, I'm just happy it wasn't Hypno again. <laughs> I thought we were going to get another Hypno. That's a really, really luscious swirl right there. That's the Illuminati Hypno with all the shining eyes. With all the seeing eyes. It's actually pretty trippy. Alright, so Tyler, we got Dark Hypno and Dark Dug Trio. I have metal in my wrists. Kind of like surgery. Mitch has PSA 9 Zard, wheel filled. Okay. He says, when you get 40, maybe sell me two. We can talk. <laughs> All right. Tyler, there it is. No Zardy, man. Manuel, you lied to us, bro. You said second pack. Sagar, you're luscious. Ooh, Matt, I like that. I like that. All right. So, Tyler, congrats on winning the wheel. Mitch, congrats to you on winning the wheel as well. That was absolutely insane. Tyler, there you go. There she goes. He says, oh, I screwed up my memory paint. My spot was taken. Let's say I was number seven for fun. Ooh. Please don't ruin the game like Magic the Gathering. All right, let's check it out. Okay, so it looks like the CP6 wheel is full. So, or not the CP6, the Charizard wheel is full. So what we're going to do is we're going to pick that winner and then we're going to get right into the orders. I promise. <laughs> All right. So this is the card up for grabs right here. This is a PSA 9 Evo's Charizard. Freshly graded. So let's see who wins. Okay. Right, so we got 17 people. Got a good old refresh. And let's see it. Alright, so only one can win. Alright. Boom. Good luck, everybody. Alright, it's slowing down. Oh, no way! Kirk with another win! Kirk, you are hot tonight! Oh, boy! Alright, Kirk, I think that might have been back-to-back -back because you just won that last shiny V-wheel. All right, so Kirk, got your name on the back. Congratulations, nice. So Kirk, this will be going over to you, my friend. And Kirk, you probably are watching if you got in that wheel. Maybe not, though. But Kirk, if you are watching, let me know if you want your shiny V-Box sealed or open. Because I think you also won one of those. All right, but very nice. So there it is. PSA 9 Zard going over to the man, Kirk. All right, so we are finally, we are an hour in, and we're finally ready to get to the orders. <laughs> 
Fernando says, are they the only packs that are available? Yes, Fernando. Unfortunately, at this moment, yes. All right, up next, we got my man Brandon. He says, two Darkness of Blahs and one Rage of Ra. Okay. It's been a while. It's been a while since we hopped into the Rage of Ra. Taco's like, rigged. <laughs> rigged. If only I had the coding skills to make a website. Okay, we got Makuyora to destroy ya. Ta says, yo, did you see someone trying to sell a Topps Chrome Box Charmander for like 50k? That just seems unreasonable for a Topps. Where are all my Capricorns at? Okay, Torchic and a Mr. Rhyme. He says, hold up, did Rand really lose the wheel? I just got back. Eddie, yes. I <laughs> don't... I don't want to bring it up because it definitely sucks, but yes. Okay, so Brandon, wow. Wow. The Pokemon was cold. The Pokemans was cold. Alright, so Brandon, Yu-Gi-Oh! going in. Alright, up next we got Victor. He says, I'm cooped up. And he says, I want three Evos with my reverses. Okay, cooped up. Let's get it. We got a Drowsy and a Clefairy Hollow. It's funny because he sniped Brody and now he got sniped today. <laughs> That's actually true. That's true, yo. Rand sniped the fossil blister. That is so true. That is so true. I forgot about that. Okay, we got a star me and we got the Imakunis. Right, so cooped up one hollow pull. Oh, that is true. I totally forgot about that. Rand did snipe yesterday. Alright, so cooped up. There you are. So it's funny how the world works. Yeah, Eddie, you give some, you lose some. That's kind of how it has to go, I guess. Okay, I'm next with my man Hunter. He says, Darkness of Blaze Battle, please. Okay, let's get you in. When you expect, when you get something good, expect something bad in the future. Honestly, that's kind of what I think. Never get them secret egg, secret egg rares from Evos yet. Shaking my head. Ellen, how have you not? How have you not? Zach says, should I get 10 darkness or 5 XY? Ah, oh, Zach, that's a good point. That's totally up to you. But Zach, I did ship you. So Zach, if you do get stuff, Zach... You will have to pay... Actually, Zach, you might have actually paid for shipping again yesterday. So, Zach, if you actually do get stuff, Zach, you don't need to pay for shipping. Alright, so Christopher, we got you six darkness. One, two, three, four, five, six. My name is Victor. Would it be possible to put my reverses and hollow rares in my bag? Yes, if you want your hollows and your reverses, yes. All you need to do when you buy packs is in your message... Uh, either just say you want bulk, say you want your reverses or whatnot, but yeah, you absolutely can. Just make sure you mention that in your note. Alright, six Darkness of Blas. Go Lurk and a Meltan. Is a top set with the first view of Lugia? No, Ryan, I don't think so. I am pretty sure it's not. Yo, King Umbreon, what's up, brother? He says, it's been a while. How's it going? He says, nobody hitting up Cosmic. Delcaddy is Scavalier. Rare Fossil and a Burtick. Okay, we got another hit coming out. Is the Houndoom. And he says, lessons were learned. Never buy more than two spots on a wheel, except if you're Tyler. <laughs> except if you're Tyler. 
All right, come on. And we got a Teddy Ursa and an Aceligal. Aceligal. Try to mention my notes. Okay, cool. So, Colin, you got it. When it comes up, I will try my best to remember. And if I don't, just keep, just spam me. Should do a PS, PS1, PS2 background. Zach, what do you mean by that? All right, Chris, let's find your back. Got you two hits. Okay, up next, we got Joel. He says, can I get two Sword and Shield, two Crimson, and one Cosmic? Okay. All right, Joel, let's do it. All right, we're going to start off hot with the Cosmic Eclipse. He says, I want six Max I to pay my shipping as well. Okay, perfect. So, yeah, Devin, you will be up soon. We don't have a huge line, so you'll be up pretty soon. Marnie and a Lantern. Brought some Hidden Fates at Walgreens. At Walgreens, really? Oh boy. Scoruppy and a Lapras. The home screen background noise. Dude, that would actually be nice. That noise is actually pretty nostalgic. I know exactly what you're talking about. Damn. <laughs> All right, Joel, unfortunately, my man, that was ice cold. Ice, ice cold. It's that coldy boy. Up next, we got Kyle. He says, one XY Evos plus for the shipping. And he says, I'm in love with you. Kyle, you about to steal my girl too, bruh. How about I steal my girl too? <laughs> All right. Polywag and a Mewtwo. Okay. So, Kyle, a little icy cold. A little icy cold for your new bag. But, Kyle, let's get you a brand new bag. When does Vista start up? He says, where's the music come from? Where the music come from? Can you guys hear the music? I actually upped the volume a little bit. Everyone always told me they never heard the music. Kyle's like, dang it, oh well. But Kyle, you now have a back. Are you buying more shiny V? Yeah, manual, I will have a lot more shiny V. Okay, up next, we got my man Johnny. He says two Evos. Okay, Johnny, let's do it. Johnny, what I'm going to do is I'm going to grab you a bag right now. V says, cold, cold, I like this. Sorry, I don't know if we're, where the notes is to put. I wanted for cards. Okay, so Devin, when it comes up, we'll let you know then. Icy says, do I have a bag? I don't even know. Icy, that's actually a good question. I don't think you do. I feel like I shipped everything you had. Boy Gal says, I like the music. All right. Johnny, let's do it. Charles says, welcome to my club. <laughs> okay. Oh, the Arcanine Tees, man. The Arcanine Tees. And we got a Tangela and a Farfetch'd. All right. Johnny, unfortunately, my man's kind of cold. Kind of cold. Okay, up next we got Josh. He says one Evos pack. Okay, Josh, let's do it. All right, one Charizzy pack. Mail says I'll wait then. How much does the shiny V packs cost? Yeah, Mail, that's a good question. I'm not sure yet. <laughs> Pikachu and an Electrode and a Here Comes Team Rocket. All right, Josh, let's see if I can find your back.
All right. So, Josh, it looks like you don't have a bag. So, Josh, I'm just going to put these to the side then. Uh, since you don't have a bag, not really worth paying the shipping for those three cards. <laughs> there is says, can we do trades later? Yes. Can't be watching pack openings at 5.30 a.m. with your breakfast. <laughs> nice. Super, super, super nice. Josh, are those good hits? Uh, not necessarily worth the $5 shipping, to be quite honest. In my opinion. All right, up next, we got my man Jason. Jason, how's it going? I actually just shipped you today. So, Jason, let's get you a brand new baggie. Thanks for paying for the shipping, and let's get you three XY Evos. Get you three XY Evos. Josh says I paid for shipping yesterday. Josh, were you in like a battle maybe or something? Because I don't think I have a bag. But some people do pay when they get into a battle too. I got an amazing Selby if anyone's interested in trading. All right, we got three Evos for my man, Jason. Jason, welcome back. All right. Oh, there we go. Got a water energy. We got the hollow Nido King. Josh says I sent 38 for a battle yesterday. Okay, perfect. So Josh, you do have a bag then. Okay. I believe you, Josh. See, I didn't have a bag for you because you didn't win. <laughs> but yes, yeah, so I'll definitely offer you free shipping. Alberta says, any Zards tonight? Ah, Alberta, we just started recently, so not, not any Zards yet. I mean, I guess if you count from tops. If you count from tops. All right, so Jason, there you are. So Jason, you now have another bag, meaning you're good on the shipping now. Okay, up next, we got my man Nicholas. He says two Evos packs and the shipping. Okay, Nicholas, let's do it. I stay awake every night just for the stream, plus I have a bad insomnia. Dude, Amanda, you're an OG. <laughs> you're an OG. But yeah, Amanda, I feel so bad. You definitely don't have to stay up super late to watch the stream. But, thank you, I guess. But, I guess I shouldn't be encouraging that. A Weedle and a Doug Trio. Sand Shrew and a Beatro. Josh, as I said, sorry for judging me, I'll take an Evo's and Blaze Pack instead. Okay, Josh, you got it. All right. I sent my man also with an offer to the Pokemon gods in it. <laughs> Got afraid of the gods for the Pokemon luck. That's literally the only way. Okay, up next, we got my man Tim. He says, let's get triple Zards again. Five Evos, please. Okay, so if you guys don't remember, I actually shipped him today. And I took a look at his bag. He was the one that pulled back-to-back -back Evo Zards. I actually need to go back to that stream and clip it. So, I don't know if anyone actually knows the timestamp from it, but I absolutely need to go and um, clip that. Okay, we got a Gary. Gary knows holographic. Eddie, how's it going? What's up? Brandon says, anybody in on the battle? Uh, yeah, Brandon, right now we have two people. Or, I mean, one person, actually. Hunter. Okay, Blastoise Spirit Link. Dream says, I can send you the clip. Yo, Dreams, that would be huge. Pikachu and a Star Me. Oh, boy. Him, last pack of luck right here. Come on. Magnemite and a Star Me. Okay, so Tim, no double Charizards this time around. But we did get a Gary. Mitch says, I did some math. At worst, I'm 40 in the red. That's assuming the Lapras pulls a 9 and 150 is as low as priced. Yeah, Mitch, I actually shipped you the Lapras as well. So, Mitch, that Lapras went... Uh, with all your other stuff. 
Bryce says, can I fill two spots in on a battle? Ah, Brand, I don't know, man. <laughs> that, that seems a little too much, you know? All right, so Tim, there you are. Welcome back to the table. Russell will be back in 30. Yo, Peter, what's up? Chris said, anyone interested in trading for my full art money bat? Okay, so then we got Johnny. He says, Evo wheel spot for Johnny. Okay. Just trying to give me one sec. Is Evo's full? All right, so Sonny, I'm going to send you a PM, Sonny. We need to put Johnny in for the wheel. So let me just quickly send him a message as well. But yeah, so keep in mind, there is a different email for payment uh, for the wheels. All right, then we got Josh. He says for the Zard wheel. Okay, and Josh, you said you were okay with um, an Evos and a Cosmic. Is that right? Jose says, is there a spot for the battle? Yes, there is. There is. Grant says, what's the wheel? If you're interested in the wheels, check out our Discord under Royal Wheel. Yeah, so Josh, let me know um, if you're what you want in exchange for the 20 bucks. So he says, thank you, sorry, sorry about that. Yeah, no problem, Johnny, no problem. So yeah, you should hopefully get put in there soon. I sent Sonny the message in case he wasn't watching. He says, a Blaze and an Evo. Okay. So Josh, let's first get you a bag. So Josh, bag has been acquired. All right. Let's hop into your darkness first. Okay, Darumaka and a Lugia. Now on to the Evos. Oh, we got a hit, I think. Okay, reverse coughing and nice. A Mega Venusaur EX. Okay. Nice. Okay. So, Josh, nice. We got some stuff for your bag. And Josh, you now we'll have a bag on the table. Gary says, can I just buy a shiny V-Box from you? Uh, yeah. So, Gary, if you pretty much... I will be putting up another wheel of a shiny V-Box. If you want to just go ahead and buy out all the spots and you want one open tonight, yeah, I can definitely do that. Okay, up next, we got my man Justin. He says, six packs of Rage of Ra. Okay, Justin, I believe in you, man. We have not yet... Can you guys believe that? We have not yet pulled that God Rare. One, two, three, four, five, six... Okay, Justin, let's do it. He says, are these first edition? Uh, Pokemon doesn't really do first edition anymore. So Pokemon doesn't really have first edition anymore. Ray says, do you have a booster box of Darks and Blaze? Yes, I do. I just pulled a Pikachu and whatnot. Toss them in my bag. Yeah, Josh, I can. I have to quickly go back there and find it. Yes. Okay, we got Mechlord Assembly and Maruka the Destroyer. I'm going to say, someone donate a pack to me. <laughs> someone donate a pack. So I'm buying Eddie Cosmic this pack for one of his Celebes. Okay. What do you think people think about CGC? I send out a PSA usually, but this can take up to six months. Holding arms, and we got a mound of the bound creator. What does it mean when you say sniped or sniped or whatever? That basically just means that somebody came in and maybe got like a couple packs and just absolutely, yeah, sniped. Like, uh, <laughs> like just swooped in. Just swooped in and like took something. A wild monster appears. So what do I think about CGC? I think if you want to send cars to CGC, you should definitely give it a try. I have never personally sent something to CGC. I'm still just a little too weary to use CGC. I think it's still a little too early. But, would I consider sending some, like, lower tier cards to CGC? Yeah, I would consider it. Cosmic's channeling. Definitely has less of a premium for PSA, but the turnaround time... I've actually heard that CGC's turnaround times are getting actually a lo pretty long, too. Alright, Justin, come on. Token, and we got an Everlasting Alloy. Alright, so the Rage of Raw, cruel, cruel set. You are just really going after one particular card. A lot 
Lux means it said it means someone else stole someone else's luck. Yeah, pretty much. Pretty much. Sort of just like someone probably like went really ham on something and you came in, you know, not going as much ham and then you just took it. <laughs> and then you just took it. Only send base and czar to CGC. <laughs> Justin, did I open you up five or six? I think I had one on my lap. One, two, three, four, five, six. Oh, no, we're good. I'm sending every blue card I have to CGC. Oh, what, to match the label? <laughs> to match the label. All right. Actually, Justin, I think I might have skipped a pack. Justin, let me get you one more pack. I think I did. You went turkey instead of ham. <laughs> Justin, I think I might have missed a pack. There was one on my lap. I'm pretty sure I only opened up you five. So let me open up one more. Ooh, nice. White Aura uh, Behemoth and a Cyber Shock Energy. Justin, I'm pretty sure that I opened you only five, so that should have been the sixth one. Sorry about that. I think it fell in my lap somehow. <laughs> Don't know how I got there, but there you go. Yo, Logan, what's up? I'm going turkey tonight. Y'all grab some popcorn. I'm going turkey. I ain't going ham. I'm going turkey. I'm going chicken. <laughs> I'm going chicken. Okay, up next, we got my man Tyler. He says 10 Cosmic. Tyler, let's do it. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Okay, Tyler, good luck. CGC label with full art Articuno looks clean. Dude, Eddie, actually, I could, I could see that. Dude. That would definitely look clean. Some people are telling me that CGC is... Ooh, nice. Venusaur and Snivy. I mean, I've, I've heard people say that the Pristine 10 from CGC is actually really, really hard to get. Uh, you know, like I said, I don't actually have personal experience grading at CGC like I do with PSA and BGS. So I can't really speak on that front. But other people have told me that they think CGC is harder to grade at. Which might mean there's an opportunity to buy a CGC graded card and potentially set it to PSA and get a good premium on it. Full art, and we got, oh, nice, Venusaur and Snivy GX full art to go with the other one. Bro, let's get the rainbow. I actually don't think there's a rainbow. Okay, Sandy Gas and a Swoobat. Magnemite, nice. Igly buff and a Weavile. Sfeel and a Lycan Rock. We got one more. Tyler, let's do it. Chris says, what's the queue looking like? About 10 people. A Lolan Persian. Okay, so Tyler taking home the Ivysaur and uh no Venusaur and Snivy. Getting tongue tied. I've graded a few times at CGC, they grade extremely harshly. If you get a 10 from them, it's definitely worth more than a PSA 10. Yeah, so see, Hunter, that's what a lot of people have been telling me. So, Hunter, I'm actually glad that you said that. So, you know, I haven't personally done it, but I always thought about potentially buying CGC-graded slabs that are graded high and are probably cheap because, let's be honest, you know, CGC doesn't really get as much. Like, as of, you know, as much as a premium. So, so you think I'll be able to get into the battle? Yes, Brand, you definitely will. You definitely will. I believe I have a lot of Italian base set in first edition Fossil Rocket. I'm not really sure, but some of them have the number one under the picture on the left. Yes, yeah, so that means it's first edition. So that's pretty good. Granted, the foreign cards don't necessarily do as well as the English ones, but they definitely uh, do have some value, but they kind of just take a little longer to sell. PSA is a little lean with their 10s lately. Yes, Alexis, that's very true. That's very true. And honestly, I don't know if it's because we send them through Express and we have such big orders that the guys might just be like, yo, I'm just done. But then again, like, that doesn't mean shit because our bulk have like 500 cards in it. 
Okay, up next we got Devin. So Devin, my friend, let me know what you'd like. So Devin, I think you wanted two XY Evos, correct? Or maybe not. So yeah, Devin, let me know what you'd like. He says, for the battle, you PayPal Sunny. No, Sunny is only for the wheel. Sunny is only for the wheel. Battles, you pay. You PayPal me. He says, six Dragon Ball Z revivals. Okay, Devin, thanks for reminding me. Let's do it. All right. Devin, looks like this box is almost over. Let me grab you a new one. He says, Volkswagen is C2C. You can use some line as a test card. Honestly, I, I've been debating it. I have been debating. I do have some low-end cards that I could definitely send to CGC. I might try it. I might. Yeah, guys, the queue's not that long. So don't worry about it. If you're asking where your line's in queue, you'll come up very soon. It's not that long. All right, let's give you six packs out of the fresh box. And let's stick these old crusty two right in here. All right, so we got some Miraculous Revival coming in clutch. Transaction said pending. Ah, uh, Juan, yes. So the transaction from Juan is pending, which basically means that I can't. <laughs> I can't uh, service that until the money comes through. All right. Devin, let's do it. He's nearly a marathon. <laughs> Maybe CGC 10 is hard to get as they are new to card grading and don't want to give out a lot of 10s. Only time will tell. Well, Super Super, that's actually a very good point too. But I guess I would stand to say that when they... So right now, PSA is super backed up. There's probably a ton of pressure on their employees to just work hard, right? Like... If I was the manager at PSA, I'd basically be like, yo, guys, you need to hurry up. <laughs> you know what I mean? You need to hurry up. Um, so there's probably a lot of pressure for them to finish their orders. Obviously, CGC is pretty new and probably, you know, now I hear that they're getting a little backed up as well. But, um, you know, once they get really backed up like PSA, we who knows? We might see them get a little lax in their grading as well. So I guess you're right. Only time will tell. All right, Devin, hopping into the Dragon Ball Z. We got Time Magic, and nice. We got Gogeta the Hero Revived. Nice. That is a super rare. That card looks sweet. I am actually really excited. The new Dragon Ball Z set comes out on the 22nd of this month. Okay, we got Soul Punisher. Damn. And we got a Fired Up Sun Gohan. I heard CGC grading is machine grade. I don't know how true that is. Ah uh, yeah, so Poke Gal, they don't completely grade it with a machine, but they do have like layering. Like they have like some layer technology <laughs> to like do that. But yeah, they don't fully use a machine, but yeah, they do partially use a machine. All right, we got a hey, Oolong always wanting more. Nice. Okay, and our last pack. Devin, let's do it. Sun Goku and nice Super Saiyan Blue testing his limit. So Super Saiyan Blue Vegeta, super super nice card, man. Gotta love these Dragon Ball Z cards. Are you supposed to accept a payment? Is that why the payment is pending? Manual. Usually I don't have to accept a payment. I don't think I've actually ever done that. I can totally check if I have to accept something on my end, but I never had to do that before.
Okay. So Devin, let's do it. So Devin, you now have a bag on the table. So Devin, that does mean now if you do purchase anything else in the future, Devin, you don't have to pay for shipping again. We're doing the new set coming out, Another Shining Fates, with the battle one forgot the moment what it's name. Yes, yeah, so Zach, you're talking about battle styles? I don't actually think battle styles is going to be all that great. Um, you know, they have a Tyranitar, but outside of that, it kind of seems to be a little lackluster. Um, but, you know, realistically, more information on the set list has to come out before we can fully, fully tell. But up next, we got my man Nick. He says, five Cosmic Eclipse. Okay, we got a Panguru and a Guzzy. Sunny Fates is going to be out of battle styles by a long shot. Oh, absolutely. No, absolutely. No doubt about that. But yeah, so maybe they'll have a nice Tyranitar card. I like Tyranitar, so that would be nice. But, ooh, nice. We got a full art wishy-washy. That's like 102 like shrimp. Okay, we got Drampa and a Golurk. Josh says, just checking with a Pikachu and the other hits adds my bag. Josh, I added just your Pikachu to your bag. <laughs> I didn't quite remember what else you pulled, but I did add the reverse Pikachu. So that's the only thing I added to your bag. But hopefully that's okay. So yeah, Josh, I did add that reverse hollow Pikachu to your bag. But that was the only one that I grabbed. Because I think that was it, maybe. Oh yeah, so I just add them to a fat pile, so it's hard to really say. It's hard to really say. Okay, Nick, let's find your bag. Alright, so Nick, Wishy Washy and Nick, I don't know if you want your verses or not, but Cosmic Clips might be a new set that you're collecting, so I will include those. Alright. Just cool, cool, there was, there, here comes a rocket swing else, I don't know, no big deal. Okay, yeah, cool, so Josh, I already, I already reached into your bag and got the Pikachu, um, but yeah, sorry about that. But yeah, of course, if you just ask for them in the future, Josh, I got you. Okay, up next, we got my man Trevor. He says, one XY Evos and two Miraculous Revival. Can I keep any Bulmas? Absolutely. Okay, let's get you tons of Bulma. All right, so Trevor, let's hop into your Evos first. It's a CB Zard promo card. Wheel full. Okay, Mitch, we'll get that as well. Dodo and a Starmie. So kind of looking a little light on the Evos. I think uh, Tim pulling two Charizards back to back. <laughs> definitely, uh, definitely, you know, did something. <laughs> okay, we got a full survival Jocko and nice. Shiron the Wish Granter. Whew. Totally the same thing happened to Pride Rock. Okay, I'll check it out. A Child's Wish and a Deadly Defender Vegeta. Okay, so Trevor, let's take a quick look. Let's see if there's any Bulma cards. Bulma, where are you? We got Pan. And a Child's Wish. No Bulmas. <laughs> Sammy says, imagine if you cut the cards. Yo, Driftang, how's it going, my man? What's up? He's like, yo. <laughs> I think Vivid Voltage is the most fun to open right now in Shining Star V. Yes, Vivid Voltage is definitely one of the more fun sets to open. Okay, so Trevor, no Bulmas, unfortunately. But Trevor, if you actually, when you request shipping Trevor in Discord, if you want, you can add, ask, add Bulma stuff. So just saying, you could just say add Bulma cards and I could definitely run through and find you one. It says for future purposes, where do I leave the note for the card I want? Do I leave it in PayPal message or direct messages? Yes, so Devin, you do it in the PayPal message. Yeah, that's weird. I don't know why you guys are pending because everything else um, came through. Okay, up next we got my man Samuel. He says five cosmic, please. 
Let's do it. All right, so Samuel, I'm going to grab you a brand new box as well. Super Gracie, where you pulled the Hollow Reversal in one pack. Yes, I saw that. I did actually see that. All right. Brand new Cosmic Box. He says, this is Trevor. Thanks, we'll do. Yeah, so just staying. No problem. Just because uh, I have a ton of Bulma cards. So if you actually just ask, I'll definitely throw in some as well. With the Dragon Ball Z, I totally don't mind. I really have no use for the Dragon Ball Z bulk, like, at all. <laughs> so. Okay, we got one upside down. Let's do it. Good luck. So this is fresh pack. Nice. First pack, we got Ultra and a Cosma and an Ursa Ring. This is how many people? Um, still about like 10. Okay, Samuel, let's do it, man. Pancham and an Entei. This is how many people are in the battle? Right now, only one. Pig Knight and an Armaldo. Roller Skater and a Lunala. Yikes. Samuel. We even cracked open a brand new box. That was rough. That was rough. But it says the CP Zard wheel is full. Okay, cool. Yeah, I meant it. We'll spin that very shortly. Samuel, that was harsh. Up next, we got Zach. He says 10 darkness and one cosmic. But before, can you snip one pack of sun and moon base? Oh, boy. All right, let's get you 10 darkness. One, two, three, four, five, six. Let's grab a brand new darkness box as well. And one cosmic. All right, so the darkness of blaze boxes have that same white powder problem. <laughs> I want a Zard so bad, I never got one. Cal, really? Everybody's got to pull a Zard, man. Everyone's got to get that feeling at least once. Seven, eight, nine, ten. All right. So, Zach. We're going to snip you a pack of Sun and Moon base. Josh is like, we love the white powder. <laughs> All right, so here it is. And I believe we'll go like this. So no one sees the color of the, of the code. One, two, three, four, I believe. So these are the two hits. All right, so I think I did that right. Open up packs all the time, yet I don't know. Okay, it's pretty easy to cut, so I'm assuming there is nothing, yep, nothing in those. I spent like 300 channel pads, ETBs, and no Zards, just promo cards. Yikes. Hey brother, I showed you a glimpse of, of your own collection a while, and off the top of your head, how much would you sell a graded or non-graded Dark Charizard Gyarados 4? Zach, that's the thing, off the top of my head, I'm not sure. <laughs> I'm not sure. Did you pull my 30k Bulbasaurs? Guys, I got tons of Bulbasaurs. You want to pay 30k for it? There's 269 likes and I rip an expensive Pokemon card. Okay, we got a Houndoom. Alright, so guys, I am working on another Kahoot. So hopefully you guys do like the Kahoot events. We will be hosting one very soon. It kind of sucks because the weekend's almost over, so maybe we'll host it tomorrow night or on the weekday. I kind of want to host it on a weekend. So maybe we will do the Kahoot event tomorrow night. Oh, 
Oh, Vicavolt! Alright, so Vicavolt full art, nice. Okay, I'll start, start running off people, I'll sell mine for 29k. Okay, in that case, I'll sell mine for 28k. <laughs> So yeah, honestly, you know, everyone talks shit about collectible gurus. It is what it is, man. It really is what it is. Like, it's one thing that he kind of did that, but I feel like people were taking it too far. Like, people were, like, giving him death threats. People were giving him death threats. And I was like, dude, you guys need to chill out. <laughs> My Perrier V coming in for our last hit. What a man, one tap, Zach. He says, how do the mods show the list again? Yeah, so Antiques, unfortunately, we um, aren't doing the list tonight. It's just me. But I can try my best to answer your question. So sorry, my, if the payment goes through the stream, does it notify you? Yeah, manually. PayPal will send me an email. So yeah. And it's like, pretty card. All right, so Zach, let's get you a brand new bag. 10, 20, even 30k! <laughs> Matt says, how much for a bag of code cards? Um, Matt, you can definitely PM me about that if you want. Okay, Matt, you can definitely PM me about that. I do have a ton. Okay, so snipping the sun and moon for the good luck. Okay, Zach, I love it, because you're right here in the front with the Z. Aaron, what's up, buddy? He says, bro, you still doing Express? Yes, Aaron, I am. I am. Okay, up next, we got my man Peter. He says, five cosmic. Okay, Peter, let's do it. We got a brand new box as well. One, two, three, four, five. I really, really, really want to see the ADP. I really want to see the ADP. All right. Peter, good luck. How much for a bag of white powder? <laughs> Josh, unfortunately, I've used it all. No, I'm kidding. Okay, first pack coming out is the Wishy Washy. Chin Chow and a Buzz Wolf. Where do you put away all those empty packs? Elijah, I actually go to the dump, dude. So I have a ton. I have a trash can. And uh, it gets full and I just empty the bags. And then at one point I fill up my whole car with trash bags. And I just dump them all off at the dump. <laughs> it's a ton of trash. Brands says, what happens if there's not enough people for the battle? Yeah, so Brands, I, if there's not enough people for the battle, we will either refund everybody or keep the cards until the next stream where more people will probably join in on the battle. Okay, so Peter, there it is. So I really, really, really want to see the ADP. Okay, so got the Torkoal Full Art and a Wishy Washy. Rand says, how many spots in the battle? Rand, it's about like, probably about like three more people. Okay, up next we got my man Eli- or <laughs> I was gonna say Alicia, but no, we got Elijah. Three, Sword and Shield Base. One, Darkness Ablaze, and one, Cosmic, okay. Three, Sword and Shield Base, one Darkness, and one of that good old Cosmic. Alright, Elijah, let's do it. Okay, we got Seismic Toad and a Mars Shadow onto the Darkness. Sent for a few things, but it's pending. Will you just postpone to next stream if it doesn't go through? Yeah, so Pride Rock, if the money doesn't get through, honestly, Pride Rock, I totally trust you, but it's just happened in the past, even with people that I've trusted, so I will have to just wait until the payment actually goes through, if I can check to see if there's some way for me to accept it, but I've had that told to me before, and there was never an option to accept it, so 
But I will definitely take a look. I do see actually you and Manuel have ones right back to back that both say pending, but everyone above you doesn't. <laughs> so it's kind of weird. And we got a Reggie Rock. So, Elijah, kind of cold. A lot of white codes, but kind of cold. The best project you'll ever work on is you. That's actually kind of facts. Hey, yo, Conels, what's up? All right, so we got Elijah with his real bag, man. So, Elijah, I actually shipped out your last bag that was under your alias. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. And, Elijah, I don't actually think you care about your bulk. So, I think I might have put them in there last time to make it fatter, but I think now it's okay. What's your opinion on holding on to Vivid Voltage GTBs? Uh, so, the main problem with the Vivid Voltage GTBs is, one, there's no promo in it. So there's no promo, so other than the packs, there's really nothing special about the, the ETB. Right? Okay, we got Joel. He says, let's see if I can snipe an Evos. Okay. Joel, let's do it. One Charizard pack for the man. Can he snipe it? Can he snipe it? And we got a break. Okay, so Stami break. But yeah, so the main problem with the ETBs, uh, especially for Vivid Voltage, is that there's no promo. And I think it only comes with 8 packs. So, it's like, if you're searching for Vivid Voltage packs, why would you ever buy the ETB? You know what I mean? The Hidden Fates ETB, that had a promo in it, a very nice one. Well, I just like my alias. <laughs> the Liam. I just sent you the clip of my Zards. Okay, nice, nice. Yeah, I th I'm going to post that like on my TikTok and everything as well. So, dreams, thanks. So, thanks. Okay. Joel, let's find you. Yeah, that was nuts. Three Charizards. Back to back to back. I also got, dude, there's so many clips. Guys, we've gotten really lucky back to backs on this stream. We had one where we pulled um, uh, two back to back like CP6 Zards. It might not have been back to back, but like within three packs of each other. So we've gotten some pretty insane stuff. I need to start keeping those clips because those are nice to like just have, you know? Nice little snippets, little memories. All right. So. We got James, Joshua, Jose. We got James, Jarek. On Jose. Okay, Joel, where did I put you? There you are. The Brody clip would be the greatest. So Sagar has a TikTok confirmed. Yes. Sagar, do I owe you for the gym two shipping? Nah, Mitch. If you win on the wheels, unless it's like super, super out there, you're you're all set on the shipping. Yeah, up next, we got my man Nicholas. He says, two more Evos. I just can't end it like that. All right, Nicholas, let's get you luckier. Let's get you some luckier packs. Charles says, any hot pulls during the stream that I wasn't there? Mm, surfing Pico. Mm, dude, I have a really bad memory. <laughs> we stream for like six hours sometimes. I can't remember anything. <laughs> but yeah, no, Julian, that Broly was pretty sweet. And Julian, that's actually off at PSA for the Express. So that's pretty nice. So hopefully, I'm pretty sure Dragon Ball probably grades like nicely. So it should be nice. Hopefully. All right. So Nicholas, unfortunately, kind of cold. Kind of cold. It says Evos is popular tonight. Evos is kind of always popular. All right, up next, we got my man Tim. He says, get me in on the battle. Okay. Tim, let's do it. Tim is like, he needs a Blastoise pack. True. <laughs> True. I have to start hoarding out the Blastoise packs. Okay, up next, we got my man Ryan. How's it going, Ryan? What's up? He says, one Sun and Moon base. Okay. So, Ryan, thanks for paying for the shipping as well. Josh says, how long does a Express take? Actually, funny enough that you mentioned that, Josh. It's actually taking a very long time. About a whole month. Our last mission's actually been there for about over a month. But I will say, obviously, there was Christmas and now also New Year's. So, 
you know, usually it takes about a month. Technically, their business, the turnaround time was five business days, but then it really went up a lot. I think they moved it to 15. All right, so right here it comes one Sun and Moon base. I saw a Dragon Ball Z card going for like 14 or 4,500. Blew me away. No, sometimes they can be really expensive, especially some of the more earlier sets. Okay, so Ryan, unfortunately, my man, now it's kind of cold. But, Ryan, you now do have a bag on the table, which means if you decide to purchase more packs, you don't have to pay for the shipping. I just sent in a 20 card, and it says 15 weeks. Well, Josh, it says, like, 15 weeks till they process your order. Okay, I'm next with my man, Ryan. He says, two Darkness Ablaze, one Sun and Moon, and one Miraculous Revival. Okay. All right, Ryan, let's do it. Wheels before Sunny goes to sleepy. <laughs> All right, Ryan, let's do it. Your Dragon Ball Z. Please give us a God Pack. And no God Pack. Okay. But yeah, we've now pulled two God Packs out of Dragon Ball Z. And nice. We got Infernal Emperor Frieza and a Resolute Strength Sun Goku. And let me grab another bag of sleeves. Dark Rice says, how much do you charge someone to get three cards graded? Sorry, I just bought three Evos, but forgot to say I want to keep the reverse hollows. Okay. Um, yeah, so Dark Rice, if you want to express grade your cards, it's $90 through PayPal, $85 through Venmo. All right. Scarberry and a Gothelia. All right, we got a Trap Pinch. And nice, we got a Mu-V. Ryan says, I'm, um, I'm in for the purchase, but did not pay, put any instructions on PayPal. I sent you a message on Discord. Uh, Ryan, you put in the notes what you wanted. So I think we got you. Mitch says, is that for each card? Yes, Mitch, it is. So yeah, they have another service that's bulk, but that takes about a year. <laughs> so for Express, you're really paying for um, the fastness, even though it's really not that fast. So, oddly enough, it's really not that fast, but yeah. It used to be. Back in the day, PSA used to actually grade your cards. <laughs> they used to actually grade your cards. And now they just hold your cards. Alright. Ryan, let's find your baggie. And Rob, we're going to skip the reverses because I don't think you care about those and your bag's already looking a little fat. Okay, so up next, we got Raul got the pending payment of 30. Okay, so let me let me write this down and make a note card. Rami says, today might be the day. <laughs> Rami, how's it going? <laughs> today might be the day. Okay, so our little pending for 30. Okay, then we got Juan Ferreira, but that is Manuel. 4-8. Okay, so yeah, no reason why those are showing us pending, but I will have to check into that, but I did just make a note. Okay, up next, we got Justin. He says, six more Rage of Raw. Okay, Justin, let's do it. Send in my cards December 14 Express to you guys. When will it be shown for those? Um, Sexolio, uh, which, what cards did you send? But yeah, PSA does, has not really moved much, even for Express. Okay, we got a Mechlord Astro, the, uh, the Eradicator. Which says, I love seeing Yu-Gi-Oh opened. Can you take out the Blastoise for Deme when my order is up as well? Yes. Okay, we got a Mound of the Bound Creator. Who says, I still have a bag. Can I see what you have? 
when you have the time? Thanks. Yeah, Julian, I think you do have a bag still. I definitely did ship you one, but I think you have another one. Okay. And so, guys, if you guys do want, uh, go ahead and put in your last orders. You need to do the wheels for Sunny. Okay, we'll do the wheels right after this, uh, right after these Yu-Gi-Oh packs. And we got Reactor Slime. But yeah, so guys, I will probably turn off the orders very soon. Because we did start pretty late. I was watching Pokemama's stream tonight. Pokemama's showing off her massive collection. Mechlord Deflection. And we got Millennial Revelation and a Reactor Slime. Alright, so this Winged Dragon of Rock continues to evade us. Now, we did pull the alternative art once, but never the uh, Ghost Rare. Because I sent in a Rainbow Charizard VMAX. Okay. So let's go ahead. We're going to do the wheels. And like I said, I will probably turn off payments as well. So if you wanted to get an order in, feel free. But I'll probably turn it off pretty soon. Because we do have a couple people in line. Okay, so Justin, there was six more Rage of Rot. Shell says, I wish I got half of Pokemama's collection. Kind of true. Okay, cool. So this is Gary. Okay, nice. So yeah, Infinity, as long as you message me on Discord, you're all set. If you want it uh, ship sealed, you're good too. We got Victor. He says, two Darks and Blaze. Can you ship my bag after these two packs? Also, I want my Rarises and Rares. So Victor, just in... So Victor, on Discord, in the request shipping channel, just put a message there, okay? So guys, I know I said we're going to do the wheel, but I, by mistake, clicked this one, so now I have to do it. <laughs> So, sorry about that. We're going to do these ones and then the wheel. So, yeah. So, Victor, just uh, feel free to request shipping in the channel. It doesn't cost any money, but just uh, message there so I know you want to get shipped. That way I don't have to remember. And as long as you send me your full name, your full email, and your address, you're all set. All right. So, Victor, there it was. And let's hop into the wheels. Do you have Sun and Moon Base? Taylor, I do. I do have Sun and Moon Base. Okay, this is Victor. There you are. Okay, so now let's hop over to the wheels. Alright, so for those who don't know, we do have wheels over on our Discord channel. So if you are trying to participate in the wheels, uh, join our Discord server, go over to the Royal Wheels section... And make sure you read this top post, this top post, excuse me, before you actually try to participate. But these are the Royal Wheels if you are interested. Okay, so we already picked the Shiny V-Box. We have the Charizard. We already did that one. We did that one. We did that one. We did that one. Okay, Charmander still has a couple spots. And that's it. Okay, so just the Shiny, or just the CP10 promos. Okay, we got Nerdy Noob in the house. Nerdy Noob, how's it going? Okay, so it's had a good old refresh. Let's do it. Okay, guys, good luck. Oops. Don't want a full screen. Okay, we're going to shuffle just so I can shuffle and immediately get to spinning. Do you expect some mail Monday? If so, yes. Uh, so probably more vivid, hopefully unified minds, and hopefully the shiny V. <laughs> and unbroken bonds. Hopefully. All right. And good luck. Here it goes. 10 promo Zarts. And that going over to our man, Tenzenberg. Okay. Tenzenberg, let's go ahead. Let me grab you the Zards right now, actually. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Missing two more. Nine and ten. All right. So Tenzenberg taking the win on that. Nerdnoob has a YouTube channel with 27k subs. Yeah, I heard Nerdy Noob um, does uh, Funko Pops. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Okay, so Tenzenberg, I'm going to make your brand new bag and put those in there. But congrats on the win. Okay, now Tenzer this is when Tenzerberg comes in. Nerdy Noob has a channel with 68k subs. 
Nerd Noob's doing it nice. <laughs> Nerd Noob's doing it right. <laughs> Alright, so Tenzenberg, not only do you get 10 promo Zards, they're all still sealed. Now push this one down just a little bit. Okay, Studberg, congratulations! Alright, so that is it for La Wheels. And I think there are still a couple left. So say sorry, if my payment doesn't go through, could I just buy a cosmic for Eddie for from my store credit? And if it comes then if it comes it's 30, maybe we can add that to my cart. Yeah, okay, Prada, we can do that. We can actually do that, yeah. Okay, up next we got Brandon. He says I'm in for the battle. Alright. Okay, Brandon, good luck. Stewie's like, spin the wheel, make a deal. Taylor says, can I order some Sun and Moon right now? Yes, Taylor, you can. All right, up next, we got my man Aaron. He says, three Evos, please. Extra five for the shipping. Okay, Aaron, you might, don't you, don't you already have a bag, Aaron? I could have sworn. May or may not. But yeah, so Aaron, when I ship your booster box, I will most likely also ship your bag. And I believe you are the one with the booster box. We're stuck on... Oh. <laughs> Sorry about that. Okay, so we got three Evos for our man Aaron. Your screen is frozen. Ah, no, it's not frozen. I was just uh, being, being a dumb. Being a dumb dumb. Okay, Aaron, let's do it. This is also perfect, thanks. Yes, yeah. So these will just go with your box. Just makes the most sense. Professor's Oak and a Farfetch. Also got the Flying Pika. And we got the Energy Arcanine. Can I buy some Evos? Energy Retrieval and a Raticate. All right. Okay, so Aaron, unfortunately, my man, those are a little cold. A little on the colder side. But these will go out with your Darkest of Blaze box. Can I get in on the Evil's Boost box? So how do I add you on Discord? But I'm new to Discord. Yeah, so Brand, if you go to Discord, there is a section that's called Royal Wheel. Uh, just take a look at that, because you will need to know how to do that. So come on, I need a battle today. Okay, up next, we got Robert for... Are you doing that for packs? Oh, man. All right. Okay, Robert, I gotta take, I gotta, I gotta remember that. This is kind of cold, but I appreciate it anyways. Yes, dude, that was kind of cold. <laughs> Sorry, that was kind of cold. Okay, so Robert, we're gonna do the same thing. All right. So Robert donating $20. $20 for the giveaway. So that's five sun and moon packs. We're gonna keep that tradition going, because honestly, we pulled two rainbow rares at one point. It says five star shield for myself, and, okay. All right. And, Robert, we're going to grab your Blastoise after as well. So, I'm going to pick a number, 1 to 36. The number you pick, I'll be betting on the roulette table with my normal numbers. King Taco, 36. 36 will take you far. Do I send the money on PayPal? If I look and see the money is not full. Yes, brand, yes. But you do pay a different uh, email. So, brand, the wheels are separate from... So the, for the stream, you pay me, but for the wheels, you pay my mod, Sonny. All right, and let's grab that as well. Okay, so Robert, thank you very much. And Robert, after we get to your bag, we'll also take out that Blastoise. All right, so we have five sword and shield base. Robert, let's do it. 
Tone says, where are your pack prices? Yeah, so Tone, I actually turned off the prices because we're almost wrapping up the stream. And we have a decent amount of orders still in the line. So I want to get those done first. Yamper and a knock towel. Oh boy. Okay, come on, Robert. I believe in you. Sinisty and a scent of scorch. Oh no. Oh no. Robert, you hit the duds. Robert, that was sad. That was sad. Okay, well, Robert, we will hop into your bag and let's take a look at what we got. Okay, so Blastoise and Pimplup, so I believe it's this one. That would make sense. Okay, and Robert, it looks like you might want your bulk. I'm not sure, though. How much for Darkest Blaze? Ah, uh, Darkest Blaze is five a pack. All right. So Deme, here it is. Blastoise and Piplup going in. Robin says no bulk for that. Okay, perfect, perfect. Okay. So up next, we got my man Terrence. Terrence, what's up, brother? He says four Evos. And he says gracias. Okay, well, Terrence, you were right up next. So Terrence, lucky you. You activated Robert's Trap Card. And now you are also getting an extra Darkness Ablaze Pack. So Terrence, there it is. One extra Darkness Ablaze Pack. This is coming from Terrence, or uh, coming from Robert. So Terrence, make sure you give Robert a big thank you. Because that's coming from him. Got Mr. Rhyme and a Drake Result. Got a Poliwhirl and a Starmie. Weedle and a Dugong. Tears like little sweet. Okay, our first hit, it is the Mega Venusaur. Okay. All right, last but not least. Oh, the Drowsy and the Arcanine Teeth. Damn. That Arcanine always making me think a Charizard's coming. Always making me think that a Charizard is coming. Okay, Terrence, here you are. And I know you didn't request your reverse and stuff, but I feel like with Evos, you know, you kind of want the reverse. They're kind of cool, I think, so I try to give... Uh, the bulk for Evos, even if you don't request it. Rand says, anyone try to do some raids? Rand! <laughs> okay, up next, we got Alexis. He says, one full box of Evos, please. I paid another five for shipping, and I want to keep my reverse hollows. He says, pretty, pretty, please. Alexis, you monster. Let's do it. All right. All right, Alexis, my mans. Terrence says, did my package for Goldie show up? Yes, actually, Terrence, it's right here, actually. Okay, so Alexis, we have you coming up for a whole box of Evos. But, for Goldie. Okay, so Terrence, thanks for reminding me, it was right here. <laughs> I was like, oh my god. Okay, come on. Okay, so Terrence, you did everything right. Love when people use masking tape. It's definitely the easiest to get off. So thank you for that. <laughs> thank you and good luck for that. Oh, here we go. Charizard from the build and battle boxes of Vivid Voltage. Very nice. Okay, cool. So yeah, Terrence, it did arrive. There it is. <laughs> Thanks for reminding me. 
He says, sorry. Why? No, don't be sorry. The tape was perfect, Terrence. You did everything perfect. More product? Yes, yeah, so man, we'll definitely do that towards the end. Okay, so Alexis, let's do it. And yeah, so Terrence, that did arrive. When Goldie pops into the stream one of these times, I'll let him know. But yeah, he's building up a huge collection of these Vivid Voltage Charizards. A huge, huge, huge collection of them. All right. So it says, did you get my order on Venmo? So let's see. Yes, Taylor, I did. Taylor, I did. All right. Alexis, let's do it. A whole booster box of evolutions. All right. So this is it. This is how you get a Charzy boy. First pack coming out. We got the B drill and we got a Mega Blastoise. All right. So let's do it. Let's get the hollow and the reverse. Glenn says, long wait. Uh, Glenn, I've actually turned off orders. But Glenn, if you do want to make an order, I'll definitely let you slide in. But yeah, I took away the prices. Chop and a far-fetched. But he says, six spots on Evil's wheel left. Fill it so we can spin it to end the night. Haunter and a dugong. So he says, who the hell big ball? And this is for Alexis. He says, did he just buy a box or did he win it? He bought a box. He bought the box. Uh, this is not the one that is up for grabs on the wheel, but our next hit is a Mewtwo EX. Okay, we got nine tails. Ooh, nice. And a flying Pika. So nine tails break. Oh, here we go. Reverse Machamp and a Misty's Determination. Very nice. Pulling out that full art Misty gal. Okay, so that's another hit. Nice hit. How much you sell the box for? Um, I actually, I'm almost going to be out of sealed boxes. So this probably is there because we have one more box going up for the wheel. So I might only have like one more. There's like so many packs I'm drooling. Oh, Charmeleon coming in with that tease. I thought it was his papa. He says, it's all good. I'm new here. I don't know the prices. Okay, Glenn, gotcha, gotcha. Need a Rand and a Doug Trio. But yeah, so sorry about that, Glenn. We started a little late. So we're ending a little earlier than usual. Sand Shrew and a Starmie. Plus, I have some pretty important stuff to do tomorrow morning. Oh, another nice full art. Raichu. And nice, we got a Mewtwo EX. Nice. All right. But yeah, so Glenn, we will be live again tomorrow if you're able to catch us. Nice, and a Surfing Pika. Okay, we're building it up. Growlithe and a Doug Trio. Josh says, whoa, I just got back. Someone buy a whole Evo's box, just the wheel. Actually, someone bought a whole box. So this is this is not the wheel. But the Evo's wheel has a couple spots left. If you are wanting to get on that, I think there's like five spots that someone said before we spin. Okay, Metapod and an Arcanine. Look how many times Arcanine pops up. So he says, who do I send for the Evo's box wheel? Yes, yeah, so, sir. Uh, so um, that goes to my mod, Sunny. So on Venmo, there is the information there. Are the Rage of Raw from a box or two-pack blisters? Dark Ray, they are from a box. Hitmonchan got a Clefairy. And yeah, so Sergio, the, the information for that is in the description under Royal Wheel. It'll have his information. When is the best time to catch you on Discord? Uh, Matt, if you just send me a message on Discord, and when I get around to reading it, I'll respond. So I guess there's not really a better price or a better time. Glenn says, wheel spots price. Uh, Glenn, it's $20 per spot. Nito King got the slow bro. He says, what do I send it on? Ah, uh, you can use either Venmo or PayPal. But Sergio, just go to the Royal Wheel Discord. Uh, the Royal Wheel under the Discord and read the top post and it's there. Okay. 
Next up, we got Dragonite. Nice, dude. Nice. That is like, you got Dragonite, Mewtwo, and a Misty. That is actually pretty hot. Dude, now we just need a Charizard. Ooh, Machamp. It says, it's sad. I look forward to seeing the surfing and flying Pikas more than the dart, the dates, because they're they are too cute. <laughs> nah, man, the surfing Pika is kind of nice. But he says it's full, Vulpix Tease, and a Mega Slowbro. Okay, so it seems like the Evo's wheel is probably full. So we will spin that as well pretty soon. The Drill. Blastoise Pack will have the Zard. Demi, I hope so. I'm hoping to at least see one Zard. Seal, and then we got a Hollow Chansey. If this booster box doesn't have a Zard, it'd be the first box that I've seen without a Zard. Kind of true. Kind of true. Usually they at least have one. The Zard is in the wheels box. You think so? Oh, there it is. Super, super easy. And there is a print line. There is a plan, Ryan. Uh, a print line right above his neck. Okay, but Alexis, you did it. Okay, so Zard number one. Hopefully, we get another one. I don't remember what pack art that was. <laughs> he says it is indeed full. Ponyta. Brand says, how do I know if I got in on the wheel? Ah, uh, Brand, if you sent over payment to Sonny, he'll update the wheel with your as soon as he gets your payment. So you'll see your name on it. Demi says, was it a Blastoise pack? Demi, I don't know, man. I wasn't I wasn't paying attention. I didn't think we'd pull it like that. Okay. Alexis, let's clean up the table just a little bit. Hopefully we can get you another one. It might not be over yet. We still have a couple more packs to go. He says it's OC though. Honestly, with Evos, it's gonna have a print line anyway, so they're very hard to get tens. They're very, very hard to get tens on these Evo Zards. Alright, let's go ahead, let's get all these packs. The thing with the Evos packs is they rip so they like shred. Like these packs literally like tear up in your hand. Look at that. Literally just like paper thin. Psychic Energy and the Arcanine Keys. Oh, here we go. Another Charizard. And it's the Mega Charizard EX. And Amanda, we got you a Flying Pikachu. So Mega Charizard EX. That is technically our second Charizard. Now, hopefully we can still see that reverse. Kyle says, your bro jumped my packs yet. Kyle, no. I actually, I see you in the queue. I see your name. So yeah, when you pay with Venmo, it shows me your name. PayPal, I just see the amount on my list. Charmander. Okay, three more, Alexis. Three more. Dugong. Conel says, this is a god box. Diglett, Drill. One last pack. Alexis, let's do it. And we're ending off with a... Ooh, nice. Reverse Gary and I'm a champ. That's basically like two, uh, that is two rares. So that's actually a pretty good pack. Gyarados can also be a hollow. All right, so Alexis, let's see, let's see what you pull in total. Okay. So of course you did pull the hollow Charizard. And on top of that, we got Machamp. Mega Charizard EX, Chansey, Mega Slowbro. We got some breaks. Nice Dragonite. Also got the Mewtwo and a Misty. Damn, that was actually a pretty good box. That's pretty nice. I'm glad the Charizard showed up because that definitely saved the box. Reverse Gary? True. Because <laughs> maybe the Evo's reprint won't have print lines. No, that's kind of the, it's kind of the opposite. So Jacob, the new ones have the print lines. 
The older, the old print, if you can get prints from like 2016, you have a better chance of not having a print line. All right. So Alexis, we're double bagging up on a Sunday night. <laughs> Double bagged up on a Sunday night. All right. So, Alexis, there it is. But she says, wheel time. Okay. She says, I don't think I can make... I don't think they make evas anymore. Yeah, Brand, they don't. But I do think that they probably have some like the Pokemon company definitely is sitting on some can I buy one each of you you can have it yes absolutely okay so give me one sec so flying Pika let's see if I can find a surfing Pika too surfing Pika we got it okay so Alexis put your bag right here Amanda let's grab your baggie Amanda, there you go. So, Alexis, thanks very much. That was pretty kind of you. I was so close to getting on the wheel, there was hardly anyone on it earlier. Yeah. <laughs> so, yeah, usually people that come, you know, if you get on early, you pretty much will get it. But once the stream starts, more people are sort of informed that they're there. So, okay, so now we have our Evo's wheel. Let's do it. Okay, so, guys, this is a huge one. All right, good luck, everybody. We got 25 spots. Okay, let's check you guys can see. You guys can see, and good luck. Oh, oh, going over to Jason. Okay. So, number one, spot number one, going over to my man, Jason. And that is one sealed Evos. Okay. So, Jason, congratulations on your win, Jason. I think you are watching. So, Jason, if you want, let me know. There's You probably want to keep it sealed. But if you do decide to open it, um, we can open it for you. If not, I'll send it to you sealed. So, Jason, uh, yeah. So, Jason, let me know when you decide. And bang. Okay, up next, we got my man Michael. He says 10 cost me Eclipse. All right. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and 10. Okay, so Michael, you also uh, activated another trap card. You get a free Darkness of Blaze from Robert. And 10. Okay, so let's hop into your freebie pack. Right, we got a Sir Farfetch'd and a Draco Zolt. Now on to your Cosmics. Oh, here we go. And it is a Blastoise and Piplup. Literally just talking about this card. Big Bot says I wasn't on the Evil Wheel this time. <laughs> okay, we got Lily's Poke Doll and a Lunala. There says one to trade. Yeah, Demi, just you're gonna have to type it again to me at the end. Oh, here we go. Gold card, baby. And it is a hey, Lily's Pokey Doll. Nice. Check that out. A little, you know, a little bit is off-centered. But still very nice. So gold card coming out, and that is Lily's Pokey Doll. Okay, very nice. We also got a full art Steelix. That is what I like to see. So just says, I've never seen that. Oh, another hit. Oh, no way. 
This is it. This is the full art Arceus Dialga Palkia, one of the chase cards. Oh my god, nice hit. Holy moly. Guys, this card is super nice. Check it out. Arceus Dialga Palkia, nice. Very, very nice. Dude, you have so many hits, and we still have more than half the packs left. Abdominal and a Whimsicott. Andrew's like, yo! <laughs> a Palm and a Zatu. Matt dropping the shrimps! Tropius, Heliolisk. Stoutland. Titanic, what's up? He says, huge hit. He was like, see, don't sleep on it. Zatu and a Trevenant. Okay, so Mike, very, very good hits, man. You got the ADP and a gold card and other hits mixed in there as well. Whew. He says, oh, you bought a Vegito figure art? Very nice. Actually, Titanic, that figure was actually gifted to me by my friend God's Gift. So he actually gifted me that. All right. So, Michael, I would say that's a pretty big win. Nice packs. All right, so let's take a look at the dreaded M section. All right, so Michael, there it is. Very, very, very nice hits. He says, that's bad for me, but congrats. <laughs> that's bad for me, but congrats. Okay, up next, we got Zach. He says, three Evo packs. Okay, Zach, let's do it. So the man of good taste. Honestly, Vegito is my it's a better fusion. It's weird because I really like Vegito, and now that I'm seeing all these Gotenks cards, um, you know. Or not Gotenks, I mean Gogeta. Hunter, we got a Mewtwo EX as well. Hunter says, is the Darkest Blaze battle going to fill up? I believe we have three people. So, if anyone does want to get in the Darkest Blaze battle, you definitely can join. Voltorb and a Dugong. He says, please keep reverses. You got it. He says, no, Gogeta is the best fusion. False. No! It says Gogeta and Gotenks are fire. Hey man, do you have any Shiny V packs? How much uh, if you do? Um, yeah, so Neol, I am out of Shiny V. Rant says, any vintage you would battle? Ooh. Oh, Rant. It's a Vegito gang gang. So yeah, Rand, I don't have super a super hefty amount of vintage, but I do have, hopefully the vintage deals that I'm making will go through, and then we could talk about battling. Right now, Rand, I'm pretty low on vintage. And I do need to keep stuff for the wheels. He says, rip Pokemon cards, terribly printed anyways. Honestly, you're not, you're not really incorrect there. All right, up next, we got Amanda. She says, one Evos. Amanda, let's do it. All right. Rand needs to recover. <laughs> Rand's, ooh, nice. Got a Gyarados. Rand's recovery is in that Fossil Blister. But yeah, so Rand, hopefully you did get the email. I did ship out your Fossil Blister. He says, where are you from? I'm from the U.S. All right. Amanda, in we go. Okay, up next, we got Rami. He says, four Cosmic Eclipse. Okay. Okay, Rami, let's do it. I'm burning the Fossil Blister as a sacrifice. <laughs> okay, we got a Nagnadel. 
Nagadell and Guzzy Guz. That win was much needed for me, but sorry, Rant. <laughs> he says, Vegito Gang, there you go. We gotta show him who's better. Vegito's better. And a Toga Damaru and a Seismitoad. So Rami. Rami quite cold. Nagadell and Guzzy Guz going in. Liam's like, Guzzy Guz! <laughs> okay, up next we got Zach. He says eight Evos. Okay, Zach, you crazy. You crazy. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. All right. Zach, let's do it. Just saw I won the box. I would like to keep it sealed. That's awesome. Thank you. Yes, Jason, no problem. Jason, you got it. Congrats on the win as well. He says cold, but GG. Yeah, Rami, honestly, it's it's all a matter of, you know, kind of like when you get in line. You can't ever really, like, predict, you know, where you'll be if someone before you is going to get packs or whatnot, so... He says, Mitch, you're the reason I'll keep bothering Sagar about Vintage. <laughs> oh, here we go. And it is a Mega Charizard EX. Hey, John, what's up, brother? How you doing? Okay, so one Charizard so far, Zach. Ooh. Okay, we got a break. Needle King break. Alright. He says, don't get me wrong, are you Indian Origin? Yes, I am. Okay, we got a Mewtwo and a Here Comes Team Rocket. So Mewtwo EX. This is back in 1999, our Poke cards were mint. <laughs> Frosty, you gotta be joshing with me. Back then, they're even worse. Okay, we got a Blastoise and we got the Imakunis. I am being watched on the streams, and sadly, I wish I got my pack fossils one day. Another hit, and it is a Venusaur EX. Tyler says, damn, you done for the night? Yeah, Tyler, it's already like 2 in the morning. And then, Tyler, tomorrow I'm going to go uh, on the interview. So that should be pretty interesting. Super interesting. I got to make sure I'm rested up, so I'm not speaking, speaking nonsense. <laughs> Right, says Tyler, let's battle our blisters. The blisters are actually, I do technically still have your blisters. They're just packed up. So they're there ready to ship. If you guys really want it, nah, I wouldn't do that. <laughs> I already packed up all your boxes. All right, up next, we got Joel. He says, let's try it again. Two more Evos. Okay, Joel, let's do it. Terrence says, which interview YouTube? Oh! Bye bye, Rayquaza. Charmander and a Beedrill. What interview YouTube? Yes, yeah, so I think um, Pokenomics with Jake and Rafi are going to talk to me. They're going to talk to me. Yeah, no, it's not like a job interview. <laughs> it's not a job interview. It's just, a po it's just talking about Pokemon. All right. The modern cards are so full of errors, they look like fakes. Right. Work. What's up, brother? He says, Ray Ray, no. <laughs> Ray Ray, no. Up next, we got Kyle. He says, three, sun and moon base. All right. Dwork says, that's awesome. Yeah. So, yeah. Should be pretty fun. 
Skipping a stream for an interview? Shame. <laughs> Got Lunala. Well, it's tomorrow. It's tomorrow. I'll stop asking questions, but I won't miss it. Terrence, you're allowed to ask questions. You're allowed to ask questions. Okay, XP share and a Butterfree. Dragonite and a Psyduck. Okay, so Kyle, a little cold. You did get one hit, though. The Lunala. Okay, so Kyle, a little thinny back. Time to build this puppy up. Are you going to feed me Shining Legends Addiction? Seriously, please find some. Tenzerberg, I actually will. I will have Shining Legends. I hope you got cufflinks. <laughs> got to dress up nice. I don't know if I because my AC is pretty cold and I take hot bats. All right, up next, we got Justin. He says 10 Rage of Rock. Okay. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And let's grab your brand new box as well. Did you get a chance to listen to the conversation with Charlie yet? Yes, I did. I did. Kelsey's gonna get the Dragon Eye Reverse. Yes. Yeah, where did I put it? Togedemaru, Sizatoad, Ralph, Decidueye. I actually have no clue where I put it, dude. <laughs> Zatu, Trevenant. Well, it means I must have put it in one of the wrong piles. Um... Yo, that's actually crazy. Kyle, did I put it in your bag? I don't see it on my table. Oh yeah, Kyle, I did put it in your bag. Okay. I was going crazy. I was like, wait a minute. He says, Raw coming in. I hope so. I hope so. Alright, so this is actually my last Rage of Raw box. Kinda crazy. Alright, we've really, really gotta see a ghost a ghost rare in this one. It has to be. It has to be. Are you getting the new Digimon TCG when it releases? Curious because they have some fire cards. Now that you mention that, I actually wasn't really planning on it. If you ever still Star Wars, Watsy, if you ever found them, shot in the dark, I know. Um, man, it's just hard because, like, for instance, like Yu-Gi-Oh, I don't really know much about it, and it kind of pains me that I don't know know like everything about it. I feel like with Pokemon, I'm pretty knowledgeable, and so it's kind of nice because I can speak upon what we're pulling. But when it comes to like Digimon, I'll have no clue what I'm talking about. <laughs> you know? Was there anything that you found particularly interesting? Anything yet you agreed or disagreed with? I'm trying to think. Let's see. Ooh, Sodgun Unification. Anything that I disagreed with or agreed with. There were some really good points. I think one thing that I really liked that I heard from Charlie was um, talking about how long it takes cards to get graded. So I never thought about it that way. That's one way I never really looked at it. We all talk about how it really sucks how long it takes PSA to grade your cards. But in a way, it's kind of like a shackle, right? So it's kind of like a shackle. If let's just say you're a person that is coming into the Pokemon hobby just to sort of flip stuff and to make some quick money and you're not really in it like for collecting or anything like that, it's going to be hard for you to get your cards graded. You know what I mean? Like it's going to take a very long time. So that's going to by nature just keep people in the hobby, not necessarily in the hobby, but that's going to, you know, you're going to have to offer up at least some type of 
not necessarily like a commitment, but that's still going to keep you in the hobby, you know, keep you in the loop because you're going to have to wait so long for your cards to get graded. So that's one way. I never really thought about it, but that makes a lot of sense. So it's a good way to look at it. Yeah, no, that totally, I never thought about it that way, but it, it makes sense. So, like, people that want to come in, and that's why I always say CGC is probably a better tool for flipping, right? So, if you're planning on flipping your cards, CGC will get your cards faster. PSA, you're looking at almost a year. Like, because most, like, most people, when it comes down to talking about Pokemon stuff, you know, it's more so that we're... So, obviously, po oh, the true name. I don't think we actually pulled that yet. That looks pretty nice. And Cosmos Channeling. And then, let's see, what other points? I just don't like Darks of Blaze. The chase cards aren't appealing to me at all. Okay, Mechlord, Nucleus, Infinity Core, and a Psychic Mega Saber. Okay, Justin, let's do it, man. You need to pull us that Ghost Rare. Okay, Mechloid, Asteroid, Dragon... And a everlasting alloy. People are literally dropping 30k cards in a single sub. PSA is swamped. Yeah, no, it's absolutely, it's absolutely unreal. That's absolutely unreal. But then they always talk about how, so I never was really into buying like the level X's. Or like the EX cards. Realistically, I wish I did. But when I was back then, when I was buying collections, I never really wanted to. Because I liked the vintage base set. And, you know, things like Watsy stuff. So. There are some really nice cards, though. I like maximum gold cards. Yeah, so Sergio, the, the sad part, like I said, is I have not much knowledge when it comes to Yu-Gi-Oh. Other than I used to watch it when I was young. used to play it. But that was back when the rules were pretty much so simple. You know? Nowadays, I have no clue. <laughs> okay, so Justin, there it is. I read that PSA was bought by a larger company. The owner of Mets and several hundred graders are being hired. Yeah, so Big Bot, they definitely did get bought out, and that might be true. My name is Taylor. I um, on YouTube. I want five sun and moon. I need a new bag. I want to keep the verses and hollows and non-hollow rares. Okay. Okay, so Taylor, you got it. Five sun and moon base. Okay. One, two, three, four, five. Do you think PSA and Beckett will ever slow down, or is it ripped from here on out? So, I'll put it this way. If Pokemon remains to be extremely popular as it is now... So here's the thing, right? There's either going to be two paths. Either one, you're going to be one of the first people to get your cards back graded, and you'll probably see good returns. But, in the future, I don't really see... Pe so I used to grade a ton of modern cards like this. We're talking like team up unbroken bonds back when these sets were first coming out So like th two three years ago, I used to be a grading machine and I would grade modern cards and sell them But the problem is is back then when I was doing that not many people were doing it You know, I was one of the not the few but I was you know amongst a couple of people that were doing it Not a lot of people were grading modern Nowadays everybody's grading modern So that's the one thing that I'm not quite sure where it'll go because I've been in, you know, I've been in around, you know. But yeah, so what I was going to say is two things are going to happen. Either the, you know, realistically, the only way people will stop grading is if it's not profitable, right? Okay, we got a Incineroar. Brian says, as we were talking about PSA, I was just skimming Reddit uh, for turnaround times, and there are nothing but horror stories. Yeah, no, Ryan. I mean, I can tell you firsthand, it's terrible. It's terrible. Um, but in terms of will they s slow down, the only way they can...
quick enough is if they hire more people or if people stop submitting, right? So those are literally the only two ways. All right, but Taylor, here you are. And so Taylor, you now do have a bag on the table, which means if you do purchase more packs in the future, you don't have to pay for shipping. So you I just ordered the chicken tender. Damn, now you get me hungry. <laughs> now you get me hungry. People are sending in their moms and grandmas at this point. Kind of true. Kind of true. Up next, we got Brittany, two darkness and one Evos. Okay, Brittany, let's do it. Um, but yeah, so, you know, it's kind of, it's kind of interesting because even back then when I was grading cards from like Unbroken Bond and stuff, like a PSA 10 would only sell for like 60, 70 bucks. But I was happy with it because the raw card was only a couple dollars. You know what I mean? So it made sense. But what I really think is going to end up happening is it's going to hit a sweet point where the PSA cards are not as expensive as they are today. And they're going to be a little more affordable. I don't know how I feel about people switching over from having like binder collections to having like... Because ultimately what happens is that there's a ton of PSA cards... Realistically, you're telling me that people are eventually going to just start collecting the slabs. So if you collect slabs, you can already kind of... You already know it takes up a lot of space, and it's very hard to... Um, you know, like, display it. He says, a year-long waiting list definitely calls for new workers. Yeah, no, Josh, that's true. That's true. Sergio says, one Evos, please, I'm feeling the Zard. Okay, Sergio, let's do it. Says the good old days. Yeah, no, the good old days were nice. That's back when your submission would actually come back in like five months. <laughs> so guys, we have one more person in the queue. Got Imakunis as well. Sergio, we will toss those in your bag. We have one more person who signed up for a Darkness of Blaze battle. So I think that'll make four. So there's two more spots in the Darkness of Blaze battle if people do want to get in. Sergio Vasquez. <laughs> Sergio, I know that's not your name, but I like the joke. I like the joke. I think 10s will hold their value decently well. So many streamers sell their openings with the idea of cards grading high. The more popular it gets, the more people send in their cards. No, steady. That's pretty, pretty accurate. Yeah. Not a bad thing, though. Well, the more graded cards in the market, the more they'll be cheaper. The more accessible they'll become. I just don't really see... You know, it's like, imagine if instead of collecting a set and putting in your binder, you collect a whole box of PSA graded cards. <laughs> All right. Terrence, we got a Machamp Break and the Arcanon. This is like the battle going. Yes, yeah, so we have two spots available if anyone does want to get in on the battle. Sogger, can I bulk my Heatran, please? You said I could this month. Eddie, there's, there's definitely no... Or I might have said that, but Eddie, we're waiting on the... um, What's it called? We're waiting on PSA to see if they make any changes. Because I don't want to accept a bunch of cards at a certain price, then they change, and then at the end of the month, uh, you know, it costs more to send them in than I actually charge. You know what I mean? There's like, oh snap. Oh snap. Okay, Terrence, you actually have some shiny... Ooh, I just showed your code. Sorry. <laughs> Terrence, you have some shiny V stuff in here, too. Some shiny V. He says, where do I get in the battle? Yeah, so Dookie, it's just $33 for a battle. Okay, up next, we got Amanda. She says, I'm in for the battle. All right. Aaron says, where's the priceless at? Um, Aaron, I can put it back up. I can put it back up. But, um, yeah, I turned it off because we're not taking orders. But since we're waiting to see if we can get one more person for the battle, then, um, yeah, might as well. It says, I plan on getting more from you when it comes to hopefully Shiny V. Yeah, so hopefully it comes soon. Should have a pretty healthy order. 
Oh, I buy a shiny V-Pack in the upcoming streams. Nice. Understandable, bro. Do you do the regular Express one and do you do it for 60? Um, Eddie, I don't do the 50 one yet. I mean, I'm considering it, but at that point, I feel like you might as well just do Express. Because the 50 one still takes a couple months. You know? Okay, we got Kyle. He says he's in for the battle, baby. All right. So we only need one more person. Uh, don't send over payment. I guess just tell me that you want to get in. So that way we don't have people and I don't have to refund. <laughs> All right. He asked, is buying cards on TCG Player? It depends on your purpose. If you're trying to buy cards to grade, then TCG is not really the place to go. Because uh, even myself, I sell on TCG Player, but of course I send in cards that I don't have any interest in grading. It's a great time to buy slabs. Springtime will be like clearance sale, I think. So many people getting their orders back, they submit it in the summer. Well, so steady. I feel like it's it kind of goes on a different... It kind of it might, it might not go like that. Because the way I see it is PSA is not just sending out mass or finishing massive amounts of orders every day they're still finishing their orders in the same amount that they were before just now they have a huge line right so it's not like psa is gonna at one point just like open up the floodgates and just send like a thousand orders out you know what i mean like that's not gonna happen so i think there still will be like you know orders getting finished getting mailed out so there will be orders coming in and people getting their slabs back i just don't i, I just don't think it's ever going to be super flooded until like, unless it gets to the point where everybody has one and they're just trying to sell, trade them at that point, then yes. But if people are holding them into their collections, then it won't be that bad. Glenn says, I'll do it. Okay, Glenn, if you want to get in, you are. So Glenn, it, Terrence, he says, one last Evo. Okay, cool. So yeah, Glenn, it's $33 for a Darks Blaze battle. If you do want to get in, uh, just send payment over to either the Venmo or the PayPal. Terrence says, new getters coming in will be helpful. It says more tents. So, I mean, dude, our express submissions have been going insanely nuts. Insanely nice. If you if you ask me, they're going pretty nicely. Um, I've seen a lot of cards come back that I'm just like, dude, there's no way that should have graded that high. Is it true that you have to print off a paper for your box to send in the cards? Yes, Eddie, you do. You do, you do. Jacob says, are there any grading services in Europe? Um, I know that there's other middlemen that do it, but realistically, they take your card in Europe, and then they send it over to the U.S. But there are grading services, I think. I think. I think Graded Gem might might do it in the U.K. I think they're, like, um, for, like, the U.K. and stuff. He says, damn, two breaks in a row. He says, I don't have a printer. Sad times. Okay, so I believe that is the last payment coming in for my man, Glenn. And Glenn wants to get in on the battle. Okay, so guys, don't send over any more money. We are done. Glenn, let's make you a card. We're going to go ahead. We're going to have this nice 1v1v1v1. And then we're going to do the giveaway. Kyle's like, I'm scared. All right, so Glenn, thank you very much. Got our sixth person. Okay, then before the battle, we have Brittany with the last order of the night. One Evos and one Darkness of Blobs. Brittany, let's do it. Eddie says, I just sent for the battle, though. Eddie, are you serious? <laughs> are you serious? If you did, Eddie, I'll have to just refund you or give you credit. So it says, I sent like $10 like 15 minutes ago. Snubble and a Blaziken. Um, Dylan, let me check. And we got a Steelers Energy and an Arcanine. Yikes. Pretty kind of cold. Since last time I did this, I flopped. Well, Kai, you got to try harder this time. Okay, so Dylan, let me check it out for you. So you sent in $10. Let me check. Dylan, was it on PayPal or Venmo? Terrence, Kyle, Amanda, Taylor, Justin. 
don't even see a notification, but let me know. Dylan, what was it through? He says, true, I wasn't trying hard enough. <laughs> he says, PayPal. Okay, give me a sec. Let me hop on there. Mark says, don't forget. Yeah, Pride Arc, we got you at the end while we run the giveaway. Kisser says, by the way, that Dragon Ball Z booster I won from had a god pack. Yo, nice, Aaron. Did you get anything good? Okay, so... Oh, Dylan, I do see a payment. Okay. What'd you say? That's weird. Okay, yeah, so Dylan, I didn't get a notification. But yeah, so Dylan, I see that. Oh, it just... The notification just came in. Okay, so weird. Alright, so Dylan, yeah. I just went on PayPal, saw it, but then I just got the notification. So Dylan, it just came through. $10. So Dylan, you didn't leave a note. Let me know what you'd like. Man, I said, Sagar, it might be pending. Let me... I can actually check the pending orders as well. Sagar, would there be any argument to open up the Gym 2 pack? Well, Mitch, the Gym 2 set has a lot of good cards in it that are not even the hollows. So you could pull the Naked Misty... Or, excuse me, you could pull Sabrina's Gaze. You could pull the Imakuni's Duduo. I mean, the No Name Chansey. Sorry, wow, I can't speak. Or you can pull the, um... Ban... Nin no, nin ugh, Koga's Ninja Trick. Wow. <laughs> um, plus there's a lot of good hollows. Blaine's Charizard... Sabrina's Gengar, Blaine's Arcanine, Blaine's Moltres, a lot of hot cards in that set, um, but the argument to keep it sealed would be that, you know, sealed is a good investment. Just having sealed product is very nice, particularly the more safe side is to keep it sealed, and yeah, do do -o. <laughs> Thinking of Naked Misty, Eddie, you got me, dude, I was thinking of it. So yeah, Dylan, I got your notification for the $10, so Dylan, let me know what you like. Got Dark Broly, Uncontrollable, Baby, Golden Ram, and Baby, the Unknown Parasite from the box. No Super Saiyan 4, Broly, sadly. Dylan says, Two Darkness, me and you. Dylan, you got me a pack. Or are you talking to Deme? <laughs> You're talking to Deme. He says, Me and Deme fighting again. Okay. Okay, so Brittany, unfortunately, those packs were kind of cold. I said, Yo, who said Naked Misty? When in doubt, keep it sealed. All right. So, here we go. I guess, ask Toby. So, yeah. So, Dylan, in the future, man, don't try not to do one-pack battles, okay? Because these typically don't end well. People just pull nothing, and then it's just like, all right, what do we do now? So, yeah. So, Dylan, if you are trying to do a pack battle, please clear it with me before you send in money for a battle. All right. We have a left and a right. So, go ahead and you can pick. And then, let's get a box with a box battle as well. It says, yo, you said Naked Misty? Yeah, Kyle. Naked Misty, it's a banned Japanese card. And Pokemon Japanese card. Demi says left. Okay. Demi, we're opening up yours first. Okay, we got a Clank and a Thievil. All right, right side. Dylan, this one's for you. Oh, you got a hit. Okay, very nice. So, Dylan, you actually do get a hit. It is the Butterfree VMAX. Nice. Okay, so, Dylan, let's get that in your bag. You actually just won. You actually just won. Poor Misty got sexualized for no reason, though. She was just standing. <laughs> Tara, she was standing naked. But, granted, yeah, it's just a silhouette. Alright. Let's go. Let's crack open a brand new box. I'm just quickly do it off the table because of the white powder. Is it worth grading first dead, even though they might be five, sixes, or sevens? Uh, if it's foreign, probably not. Okay. 
Okay, here it comes. We have the 1v1v1v1. One 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 one. Pikachu voice is a 80 some year old woman. Did you know that? Yes, Eddie, I did actually. I did. She, re she is really old, actually. <laughs> kind of crazy. One, two, three, four, five, and six. So the long awaited Darkness of Blaze battle. Let's do it. So we got a battle coming up. Then we will do the giveaway. And do any trades for you guys while the giveaway is open. Alright, so Darkness Ablaze. It has been a hot minute since we pulled that Charizard. Omni says, Sorry, will you have more Champions Path? Omni, actually pretty soon. Hopefully by Monday. So hopefully by Monday. Alright, so let's go ahead and let's deal the packs. Okay, so congratulations to all the winners of the wheels tonight. We had some pretty fire wheels. You guys like those wheels? We had some pretty nice wheels tonight. And last but not least. Okay, let's get the tried and the true shuffle. Yo, Just Amazing Foods $10 dono, brother. Thank you. He says, keep the grind and the hustle going. Dude, Just Amazing Foods, thank you, brother. I appreciate that. Thank you, man. He says, do a table shuffle. Today, I got a Butterfree VMAX. Yo, thank you, guys. I appreciate that. So, Just Amazing Foods, thank you, brother. I really, really appreciate that, man. Thanks. And thanks for stopping by again tonight. I won a tin at PokeGal Stream. I saw that. I saw that. Robert, too. Okay, over here on the right side, we got Tim. Next in, we got Glenn. Then we got Brandon. We got Hunter. It's kind of funny how I went from just writing full names to just last names. <laughs> Adam and, ooh, left side curse going over to the man, Kyle. Ooh. All right, let's do it. We got our nice, look at that. We got Misty chilling in the back. She knows we're talking about her. <laughs> Just want to say, I was, I was one of the ones in nighttime sitting around opening booster box after booster box was awesome. Can anyone buy packs? Uh, Karen, yeah, if you're talking about on the stream, yes. But Karen, we're pretty much almost done with the stream tonight, so it might be too late to buy packs. But we go live almost every night. Just Made Food gives a thumbs up. Yo, thank you very much. So Just Made Food, thank you so much for that dono. Thank you, man. All right, Tim, let's do it. But she says, who won the Evo box? Uh, the Evo box went over to Jason. Okay, we got a... Santa Scorch. Okay, Glenn, over to you. Yeah, so Jason won the Evo's box, and he decided to keep it sealed. Misty and Kim, get me in, into gingers. You talking about Kim Possible? <laughs> okay, Hunter. Jigglypuff and a muck. Got Amanda. Doug Trio and Decidueye. Over to the man Kyle, all the way on the left. Oh, Kyle. Ooh. Oh, it's just a stunkfish. <laughs> okay, so full art stunkfish coming in for the left side curse man, Kyle. Okay, back over to the right. Angel says, what cards cards have you pulled so far? Um, Evo Zards. We haven't opened up any hidden fates. And we haven't opened any CP. And we haven't opened up any vivid voltage. <laughs> so, yeah, so just pretty much Evos. Pan poor Gramble. We got Hunter. Kim Possible, Impossible, Waste Proportion. Don't get me started on Shigo. Dude, I didn't like Shigo, man. That green, that greenness wasn't really about it. Wasn't really about it. Saravia and a Caparaja. Over to our man Kyle on the left. Another hit for Kyle, and it is a Vicavolt. Okay, so Kyle, you're actually pulling out a lot of hits. Okay, 
Okay, starting on our right side, once again. Clink and a Greedent. Glenn, over to you. What if you opened a pack full of blanks once? Full of blanks? Brandon. Mitch says you're wild for that? Mitch, I think you're wild for liking Shigo. Hey, Lightning, what's up? Sinistee and a Wiggly Tough. Over to Amanda. Matt's like, left side. More low Manetric. Pokey Richie says how to enter giveaway. Uh, Pokey Richie, at the end of the stream, we'll do the giveaway. So to enter the giveaway, only two things need to happen. Uh, firstly, you need to be subscribed to the channel. And secondly, you'll need to enter the form. The Ultimate Air Pack. All right. On the right side here. Sal's like, hype me up. There we go. Everyone's hyping up Kyle. Ooh, we actually just got a Salamance. Someone called that. Okay, so Salamance for our right side player, who I believe is Tim. Glenn, over to you. I've seen a video of modern packs being half energies. I've actually seen errors like that as well. Wishy-washy, Talonflame. Vanillish and a Hoopa. Over to Amanda. Come on, Charizard. Pop out already. Kyle on the left. Ursa Ring and a Thievul. Okay, starting off on our right side once again. He says, ah, oh, is this a seven hit box again? I hope not. I really hope not. But four people have not had a single hit on their board. Marnie Dracovish. Shell's like, where are all the hits? Chanel, these boxes are so brutal. Hunter. Ferret and a Wiggly Tough. We got Amanda. I think so far we have like four hits. Funnel B and a Heatran. Over to Kyle. He says, is that Vegito you have in the corner? Yes, Angel, that is Vegito. Melmetal and a Seligor. Yikes. Yikes. We are on our last round. A ton of people. Not a single hit on the board yet. Just says, are these from the reprint? Yes, Chanel, these are from the reprint. He says, return this case three boxes in a row. Actually, that's not actually necessarily true, Mitch, because we did... Um, I did send out a bunch seal to the ones the people that won the wheels. Okay, right side, and that is a Morlol and a Leopard. Okay, Glenn, over to you. Come on, we need to see some more hits. No shot. Volcarona and a Struggle Glove, Glenn. Not a single hit. That unfortunately means you're out. Okay, we got Delcaddy and a Toxel. Brandon, you are out as well. We got Hunter. Oh, we did get a Charizard. So Hunter actually pulling out the Charizard V. So Hunter, we're going to keep you up. Because the Charizard V might actually be worth more. Up next, we got Amanda. I don't know everything I've ever seen a battle this cold. Dude, this is actually really, really bad. Amanda, not a single hit. Okay, Kyle, last pack. And it's a cold pack. Jesus, dude, I think we actually only... Is that only five hits? Bruh. Oh my god. That can't be possible. That can't be pop. That's one, two. That is five hits. Bro. That is disgusting. Oh my god, that is disgusting. Dude, whoever... If you want a Darius of Blaze box, don't open it. <laughs> don't open it. Oh my god. That is low-key disgusting. I am sorry, guys. Holy moly. Addy says resealed. I can promise you these are not resealed. I can promise you. But that is absolutely, absolutely disgusting. Suka says impossible. I promise you these come straight from Pokemon. Straight from Pokemon.
That's the worst Bloxy ever in history, 100%. This is why I don't mess with Darkness. Firebox is like, I'm not buying Darkness anymore. Karen says, that's a whole booster box? Yeah, Karen, that was absolutely disgusting. <laughs> I was like, that's crazy. All right, let's hop over to TCG Player. And honestly, that is so sad, guys. I, that, that actually made me sad. That was a terrible box. That, that's actually the first time I've seen something be that bad. He's like, yikes. Yo, BZ, what's up? He's like, when you step your toe in the middle of the night type of box. <laughs> I thought I had bad luck. Rip. Brand. Bad for the brand. All right. Okay, so. Just checking. Let's see how much that Charizard... Yo, Charizard V is $9. I kind of knew it. So, Bandai's Blaze Battles because of that. Yeah, no, I probably will, I'm, I'm, I'm stocking up a lot more on Vivid this time, rather than four cases, I'm going to go double that. So we should have a lot of Vivid Voltages for battles, because that was absolutely disgusting. Darkest of Blaze has been pretty shitty the whole, what is that? Okay. So 9.02. Alright, so our first person has the Scent of Scorch, which is actually surprising. Oh, there's no way Scent of Scorch and Salamance are going to beat that, so that's 652. And Salamance V is 176, so nope. And Stungfish Vicvol, yeah, there's no way. That Charizard V actually just won. So Hunter, you actually just won. Wow. That was a five hit box. That is disgusting. So Hunter, even though you won, man, I am so sorry. That was so bad. I'm never going to invent a new card game. Boom. <laughs> Frosty, there you are. Frosty, now now, now I'll accept what you were saying. Now I'll accept it. Hunter in the red. Can I start setting my cards to express with you? I know you're waiting for PSH to now. price change it, but I'll pay it anyways. Yes, Eddie, you can. Eddie, you can. For the new bin, you have all recycling you have to do with the packs. You have to recycle to throw away. Yo, amazing food. $20 dono. Yo, amazing. That's actually huge, bro. Thank you. No way. A $20 dono. Dude. Yo, amazing foods. Thank you, brother. Holy moly. Yo, amazing foods. Thank you, bro. That is huge. That is actually huge. Jesus, yo, amazing foods. Thank you, bro. Kurt says, I wanted to get in the battle. Thank God I didn't. Are you excited for Shining Legends? Yes, we will have my, we will have more Shining Legends. Terrence says, Chick-fil-A fun. <laughs> I'm never buying Pokemon again. Yo, amazing foods, bro. Thank you so much. That's 20 and 10, bro. Thanks. Whew, amazing food. Thank you, bro. He says, hola, brother. We all in. Bro, thank you so much, man. That's huge. All right, we're also going to throw in two Dragon Ball Z packs, as well as all of the Sun and Moon. All right, so let's quickly just go ahead. Let's set up all the boxes. All right. Kyle says, where's the giveaway? Yes, the giveaway is right here on YouTube. Well, sort of those buddy fight cards. I've heard of them. Okay, so guys, the form is being made right now. He says, keep it for the soul. Yo, no, seriously, amazing foods. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Plus he says, does Target have Darkest of, uh, Dragon Ball Z? Yes, they do actually. I have seen it. So what's up when I'm buying Crash Well and I walk her at Target? I mean... <laughs> All right. 
So guys, to enter the giveaway, two things need to happen. One, firstly, you do need to be subscribed to the channel. And secondly, you need to fill out uh, this link right here. So I will check if you are subscribed to the channel. If you're not subbed, if the winner, if the winner of the spin is not subbed, um, I will just simply pick a new person. So you do need to be subbed uh, to win this giveaway. And you also need to fill out your YouTube name on this Google Forms. Our first entry was Denmate. Damn it, that was quick. Mike says, I've been watching all night. It's been amazing. Well, outside of that box. True, <laughs> Mike, true. That box was herocious. Absolutely herocious. Denmate says, first in. Yeah, damn it, you're the first. So for tomorrow's wheels, we will be putting up some more tops packs. If you missed the tops pack, we will have some more for that. We'll probably also have another gym two pack up on the wheel tomorrow as well. It was Denme then Kyle. Kyle was second. You guys might actually like seeing this. Let's put you guys over here. So yo, amazing foods. Thanks once again, dude. That was huge. All right. Also, um, Taylor says, are you done opening up packs for tonight? Yes, Taylor, we are. Okay, so guys, if you want to make any trades or anything like that, now's the time. Michael says, was I second? No. <laughs> Michael, you are all the way down here. So, Michael, you got beat by like 10 people. <laughs> so, yeah, this is the order. So, you can see the order here. So, the last person to enter was Big Bod. Mike says, how do I enter? Yeah, so I'll put the, I'll put the link one more time. So, Pride Rock, you wanted to get one Cosmic Pack for Eddie, right? Michael says, how can you see? Yeah, so Michael, it's just this list. I had time of 6.2 seconds. How do you know how fast you were, Deme? So yeah, so Pride Rock, let me know if you do want um, to uh, get that Cosmic Pack. So just confirm me one more time. If you guys want to make a trade or anything like that, let me know. I says, wow, I was fifth and I felt hella slow. Let's check it out. Who was last? We had Big Bod, Liam... On Teresa. One cause of the eclipse, okay. Okay, so Pride Rock will change that to seven. And then when it comes through, we'll make that thirty seven. And let's get one Cosmic Eclipse pack for Eddie. Okay, good luck. I am on there. Am I on there? I have no idea what this is for. Uh, yeah, so Alexis, it's just for a bunch of uh, packs. Fion and Bacephalon. So unfortunately, Eddie, that was kind of cold. says am i on there for the giveaway so here i'll scroll through the list so guys we'll give it like another 30 seconds to enter if you haven't already i see michael j we got mitch in the house dustin's in the house as well okay so yeah new people coming in it do work let's see we got paul <laughs> youtube link <laughs> yeah mike bell you're there <laughs> all right he says, don't forget the Celebi. Uh, he says, because it's for Eddie. Okay, Celebi, got it. That's actually super lucky. I was so close to shipping Eddie's stuff because Eddie actually has a lot of CP6 stuff too. So super close to shipping Eddie this morning.
he says, oh no, not my bag. All right, so Eddie, let's find your baggie. Wait, Eddie, did I ship you? Eddie, I might have actually shipped you. <laughs> Let me double check. I don't see your bag here, and I don't see your CP6 stuff. Okay, give me one sec. Let me take a look to see if I shipped. I was going to buy packs today, but I'm waiting for Shining Legends or Champion's Path. Yeah, so Omni, I should have that pretty soon. Because I didn't get an email if you did. Oh, Eddie, I did, dude. Eddie, I did. So here, I don't want to reveal anything, but Eddie, you probably don't care if you can see your tracking number, right? You probably don't care if they can see your tracking number. Dude, Eddie, I literally, you were the last one. I thought I didn't, but Eddie, I guess I did, dude. So yeah, dude, Eddie, I actually did. You had so much stuff, I had to. So yeah, you can see here all the people that I shipped. But yeah, I, I won't show further, but yeah, Eddie, you were the last one. Just thanks for the free pack, get scammed. <laughs> dude, Eddie, I'm sorry, man. I already packed up your stuff. It would simply be too much. I'd have to, like, ruin everything to get that Celebi out. So, Eddie, I did ship you. Yeah, they're like, uh... <laughs> Yo, I'm sorry. Yeah, Eddie, you don't have a bet. Your Celebi's not... It's actually still here, but, dude, realistically, it'd be so much. Alright, so guys, last 10 seconds to sign up for the wheel. Alright. Okay. Dizzy Pokemon, is that the real one? That's funny. Just since our eight, maybe you can add it back to my card. Yeah, I actually could. I could add it back to your card. Alright, let's do it. Damn, we got 91 people! Okay. So good luck, guys. Whoever wins this giveaway. That was the longest 30 seconds left. True. <laughs> Terrence, true. Alright, let's take this out. What's going on here? Hi, I don't know what this is. The answer is Charizard. <laughs> the answer is Charizard. All right. Okay, I think we're Gucci. I think we're Gucci. Let's do it. He says, I'm winning no matter what. Josho said my bag got delivered, got my Zard and Jirachi. Nice packing. Thank you. Yeah, so Josho, glad it arrived safe, man. Thank you for letting me know as well. All right. Let's do it. Oh, Master Blaster. He says, whoa, just made it in time to witness the spin. Yo, amazing foods. Give, give 20 any pack for any subscriber for you, bro. Yo. Let's go. Okay, so amazing foods, you want me to give someone uh, $20 in packs, right? All right. Yeah, yo, Yizzy, uh, have me on your tea time, man. Have me on your tea time. <laughs> I'm down to sip some tea. Okay, so Master Blaster, you here. He says, thanks. Master, you changed your name, right? Master, let me know if you have a bag or not. Tara says, I hope to win one one day. <laughs> Give me please so I can trade with Eddie. Pick you. He said, that's crazy. That's crazy. <laughs> so, Master, let me know. I feel like you changed your name, Master. Karen says, cool. He says, please, my payment went pending. He says, keep that good soul. Yes, anyone, bro. Okay. So, we'll spin one more time.
All right, so, yo, amazing foods, bro. I will put that on you. You pick. Yizzy says, you got tea to spill. Ah, yeah, Yizzy, I mean, I don't really got, like, some, uh, you know, I don't got, like, the juice, but I definitely got some tea. But I ain't got the juice. I got some tea. I got some hot takes. <laughs> I got some hot takes. Demi says, split it. Sugar, I'm going to send you $8 so you can add that. Okay, Eddie, you got it. Mike says, what a great time tonight. Yeah, Mike, thanks for hanging out with us. Master says, no, I don't have a bag. Okay, so Master, um, yeah, so Master, I'm going to put your bag down as your username, but you should definitely message me on Facebook or, dis or definitely just message me on Discord. I mean, this food's like, my hands are up, man. <laughs> I'm hungry. Yo, Terrence, me too. Me too. All right, so we still have one more giveaway. I'm going to try to let Amazing Foods pick. All right, Master, let's do it. Hey, I think you got my bag name wrong. Last name wasn't Warson. Hunter, let's take a look. He says the 2M. Hunter, let's take a look. Hunter. Now the chat goes crazy. <laughs> Hunter Wizen. Hunter, that's not you? That is you, Hunter. Yo, yeah, that's not Worsen. That's Wizen. But my handwriting's pretty bad. But I'm going to add the Berg. I'm going to add the Berg. That's helpful. Okay, Hunter, I updated your bag. He says, manual music and Terra. Okay, okay. You got it. Let's do it. All right, yo, congratulations. So, Master Blaster, let's do it. We got you some sun and moon. Congrats on winning the giveaway. So, yeah, no, no, Hunter. I just have really bad handwriting. <laughs> but I did add the uh, last part of your last name, so thanks. He says, spin that wheel again. He spoke. He said he wants to give it to Terra and manual. Jack in the box tacos sound good, dude. Trust me. Okay, got cutie fly and a parasect. I could always use new packs, just amazing foods. Heard here and a hariyami. Hariyami. Arachnid and a rangaroo. Everyone's saying I hate scalpers, dude. That's the one thing that I I could definitely argue with people about is everyone's hate for scalpers, man. That's the one thing I don't understand. I don't understand. Okay. So now on to the Dragon Ball Master Blaster. Let's do it. Demon wants my Colossal VMAX for his Mew and Talonflame. Okay. Okay. So we got two Dragon Balls. Let's do it. it says Krusty says, You in Cali? No, I'm not in Cali. I'm on the East Coast. East Coast is the Beast Coast after all, know what I mean? Okay, we got a Father Reunion, or Faithful Reunion, not Father. <laughs> not Father. Not quite there. And a super speed piccolo and nice. We got unyielding moves, unending moves. The hollow is so flashy, you can barely read it. All right, so Master Blaster, there you are. Congrats on the win. And Master, you're gonna have to let me know when you message me on Discord uh, that your bag is under Master Blaster, all right? Because I don't have a real name to tie it to since you won. I bought resale prices a couple times. My pockets hurt, though. Yeah, I feel you on that. I feel you on that. And he's like, Midwest gang. <laughs> Midwest gang. All right. 
Biggie versus Tupac in a boxing match. Probably Biggie. <laughs> Probably Biggie. All right. So up next, we have some packs. Okay, so you had picked Terra and Manual Music. All right, so Master, when you send me your full name, address, and email, make sure you also mention that it's yours. Okay, also, Eddie did send over the money as well, so Prydark, we're going to change you back to 15. That says I'm in shock. Will you trade? Yes. Let's get your bags. Bro, wait, will you trade please his colossal V Max? Will you trade his Colossal VMAX for my Talon Flame and my Mew? Okay. Okay, so Colossal going into your bag. And Mew and Talon Flame going over to Pride Rock. Okay. Tupac all day, yo, pokies, but Tupac is, you know, he's not that. Eh. Okay, so let's go ahead. What can I give away? All right. Or not give away. Let's get you some darkness. That's a nice, easy 10. All right, so the first two coming up, these are for manual music. So, Manuel, these are coming over from Amazing Foods. Semiseer and a Darumantan. Larion and an Escavalier. Okay, so kind of cold. Kind of cold. He spins circles around Biggie, though. That could be true, but you never know, man. Biggie, he's definitely been in some shit. You know what I mean? Okay, Terra, over to you. Oh, we got a hit. All right, we got a stunk fish. Okay, Agassiz is one open. <laughs> All right, let's do it. Beer tick and a flygon. Okay, so darkness ablaze. Terra, pull in the fuller. Or not the fuller, just the V card. But still very nice. Alex is like, the fish. Pokey's like, you right. Yeah, you know, Ricky, honestly, right? Kendrick, what kind of question is that? Kendrick Lamar or Naz? Oh, of course, Kendrick. Dude, what kind of question is that, dude? And she says, yeah, Tupac was a diva. Well, Tupac's still in Cuba. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. Tupac's still in Cuba. Sorry, why don't you expect Burning Shadows? Eddie, hopefully very soon. Saga versus Yizzy boxing match. Okay, therapy. Nah, man. I love everyone equally, man. Me and Yizzy don't need a box. We'll just sip some tea together. We'll sip on that tea. I says, be humble. Sit down. Who wins in a league match? Oh, of course I'll win in a league match. Of course. Right, so guys, long or not even that long. Usually we go six hours, but only about a four-hour stream tonight. But hopefully I will see you guys all tomorrow night. Um, hopefully I'll get some nice mail in tomorrow. I wouldn't cross my fingers on that. But um, yeah. So as always, if you guys need to reach out to me, you guys can easily see me on Discord. That's the easiest way to reach out to me. But yeah, other than that, I want to thank you guys all very much for hanging out with me tonight. Um, amazing Foods, thank you so much for those donos, man. That was huge. So thank you very much, as well as Robert. Robert also dropped 20 for the giveaway as well. 
Now pick any... Now, you pick now, brother, for any 20 packs worth for me. Yo, another $20 dono. Yo, amazing foods. Bruh. Yo, amazing foods, man. Whew. Well, I mean, I can't end it now. I can't end it now. All right. Amazing foods, man. All right, I think what I'm going to do is... I'm going to open up two CP packs for myself. Yo, amazing foods, man. Thank you so much for all the donos. Lycan Rock and a Hatterim. Come on, give me that Charzy. Oh! It's the Gardevoir. <laughs> Alright, so Gardevoir coming on out. So, yo, Amazing Foods, bro. Thank you so much. That is huge. So, Amazing Foods, you are one of the most generous people, man. Thank you so much. That is huge. That is huge. So, yo, Amazing Foods, brother, thank you so much. Super, super nice of you, man. So, thank you. Everyone's like, Pog? <laughs> Pog. So, yo, Amazing Foods, bro, thank you so much. So, let's go get some Amazing Foods. True. True. Alright, so that is huge. There says, good everyone, thank you for the positive vibes. Yes, yeah, so guys, as always, thank you guys all very, very much. <laughs> Save Poggers in chat. <laughs> we got Polish Rock in the house too. Man, we got a huge house. Sad that we got to end. It's 3 in the morning, but we had to end. So Yizzy, uh, Polish, Ro Polish Rob, thank you guys for hanging out tonight as well. As always, thank you to everyone who was here tonight. Always a pleasure. I'll hopefully see you guys tomorrow. We will have some more wheels for tonight. He says, Mr. Beast in disguise. <laughs> hey, if the wheel I'm in doesn't fill by Monday, can I use the entries towards a different wheel? HQ, yes, we could. But all right. So, yo, amazing foods, brother. Thank you so much. You are so kind. So thank you so much for those donos, bro. You actually made a ton of people's days by getting them some packs. So thank you so much for that. But as always, guys, thank you all for hanging out with me. I'll see you guys tomorrow. And as always, stay safe and stay awesome.